and subscribe to me, please. Please subscribe to me. Please, please, please. 26 moths. Here's to 26 more. They will eat your clothes though. Forklift time? Fork yes. Subscribe to me, please. Please subscribe to me. Please, please, please. Howdy, hey. Howdy, ho. How we doing? Welcome to the show. Subscribe to me, please. please hey, everybody. Please, please, please. Thank you, Dan Persona. Boeing 737 Classic. Even Right Guy Raven Mutated Wisdom. Thank you for the first couple subs of the night. Wolf Clock. What up? Hey, everybody. In Forklift Certified. You do know this song. It's Rap Snitches Knishes from MF Dooms. Why is my why am I drawing a blank? Food? Sold. Your what is the album? Is the album just called Food? This is one of my favorite albums of all time, and I can't remember it. To me, please. Please is it just called Food? Mmm, Food. Yeah. Okay. Okay. That's what I was forgetting. <laughs> we need food. I haven't listened to that in. It was probably right after MF Doom died. Rest in peace. All right, baby. We are at two years of being six. That's so by sad. That's still so sad. In a row. Time for some fantastic Thank you. Necromancer of a big festivities pit. featuring frequent forklifts. Mm hmm. Nice alliteration there. Hat MP multiplayer hat. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Gigalovania. I am a person. Honey fluff. Thank you. Bensard. What's up, guys? Hey, everybody. Hey, y'all, folks. It's not fucklift fuck day. It's forklift. All right, chat. How many forklift drivers we got in chat? Whether you do it currently or whether you've been certified, I know there's some. Raise your hand. All right, here's a tip. Here's, when I ask a question like that and it doesn't apply to you, don't say not me just because that's like, okay. I want, I want to, like, I'm trying to count how many people are saying me. When you say not me, it throws off my count, you know? All right, so it looks like we got about 100. 100 forklift users. I'm estimating. Apples? Apples? Hello, That's your first time people. message? Hello, Wayne. White. Hey, what's up? Subscribe to me, please. Please. Astro Meter, what is going on? Hello. Hello, folks. Let's lift some fucking forks. I believe in you, Wayne. Welcome, Corny on the Cob. Thanks for tuning in. Thank you, Prowler Pangolo. Have yourself with the Prime Sub. Thank you, everybody. Trefated Facade. Welcome to Forklift Friday. I'm gonna search forklift music on YouTube and see what comes up. Alright, let's hear it. This is the first result. Perfect Dracula impression. Hello. The only forklifting I can do is when I eat a big bowl of pasgetti. Am I right, gamers? Let's do oh, let me get this on screen. Awesome. Holy shit, we're almost there. Of course this we're exists. Of course this exists. A better truck cannot be found. I've never considered a forklift to be a uh, to be a truck. Where's the Jersey Club mix? Oh, if someone made that. Oh, if someone made that. I should have got Nano Ray to make a fucking <laughs> a remix of this. Unfortunately, I just found this. This is a training video? No fucking way. I crashed my forklift. This shit is four minutes long, so if it's a, if it's a training video, then we haven't. 
If you showed this to your fucking employees that had to do that had to do forklift shit, oh my god, they would quit. They, they would be like, "What the fuck is wrong with you? Why are you like? Why are you pandering to us?" No, this is, this is a, it's a, literally a YouTube kids video. It's not a training video, but I'm obsessed with that concept. It literally says for children in the title. I know, I know. That doesn't mean we can't jam out to it. <laughs> Whoa, look at that. Really heavy loads, chat. These blades are attached to a part called the carriage. And forklifts can lift their loads really high thanks to this part, called the mast. It lifts the carriage and the forks way up high. It can go slow. And then food. Fast. That's so fast! It takes to do it right. The driver usually tilts the load back when he's lifting and carrying it so that it doesn't slip off. He doesn't want anything to come tumbling down while he's lifting it to the top of the Wayne, I am currently searching for the audio of you playing Dota and yelling at Trog to eat bellies and your impression of that. Oh, I mean, that's not anywhere publicly. You'd have to find that in a random VOD where I played it. Turn around! Rough snitches. Oh, bars, bars. Sometimes it's a bad Sometimes it's a battery pack. In case things come a tumbling down, the forklift has an overhead guard. These lyrics fucking rule. In the lumber yard, do the forklift. No clue. Wrong, wrong. No one was ever conceived to this song, ever. Unless there's someone on Earth that... No, I, no, I don't even want to say that. I don't want to say it. Unless there's someone on Earth that is like... You know the concept of like playing Mozart for the child when they're in utero? When you, when you, when 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 someone is pregnant and they play music into the womb? Like, this is... That's like the... If someone was conceived to this song, that means they were taking that concept way too early. And they really wanted a forklift driver for a kid. Which... Don't know why you would want that. Specifically, if a kid ends up driving forklifts, oh, there's so many. We'd watch Dump Truck, Impact Hammer, Bulldozer. Haha, my son's gonna be an Impact Hammer user. Huh? Oh, yeah. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed that. I hope that gave you a little bit of a rundown. If you don't know what forklifts are, now you do. Old caps. And you know all about it. We can't watch the Dump Truck song, you have to wait for Dump Truck Tuesday. I don't think I, I don't think there's that many games about dump trucks. All right, well now I'm gonna look up the dump truck video game. You know it's sad. I wanted to include Shenmue, but like I don't know what part of the game the forklift part of Shenmue is in. Uh, so we'll have to save that for the 24-hour Shenmue marathon, whenever that happens. Uh, dump truck video game. Heavy excavator dump truck 3D. Oh, this is just construction simulator and like weird app games. Dump Truck 2020 on the Google Play Store. Awaken the dump truck driving 2020 inside you. <laughs> I want to do it. I want it. Do you love off-road truck simulator games 2020? And would you like to enjoy free off-road dump cargo truck simulation games 2020? If yes, then you are in the right place of Off-Road Truck Simulator 2020. Off-Road Games 2020 has a huge collection of exciting and thrilling Dump Truck Games 2020. U.S. Dump Truck Evolution Simulator Games lined up for you to play Bulletproof Dump Truck Driving 2020. And have lots of fun for as long as you want in U.S. Heavy Loader Truck Simulator Games 3D Hill Climb Drive. Awaken the Dump Truck Driving 2020 inside you and hop onto any of the real dump trucks as you see in our games. Let's see the reviews. I forgot my flashcards for my forklift certification test. Pretty good reviews. Pretty good reviews. <laughs> Dump truck game application is very outstanding. Dump truck is a tremendous game. It is a full of adventure game. Its feature and graphics are tremendous. <laughs> we could probably, I could probably do an entire stream just reading reviews on the fucking Google Play Store of shit like that. It's so good. It's all kids. It's all kids or bots? I think these are bots. 
Because they all Just refer to it as Dump Truck 2020 mind. game. Oh, hey. Hey, Valve's here. Hey, hello. Hey, you just missed. I, I was just reading about uh, US Dump Truck 2020. Nice. Okay. What, what about doing, it? Val? Mm -hmm. Huh? What, what about it? Uh, US Dump Truck Simulator 2020 is a full, it's a, a game with grand Whoa. feature, full uh, of graphics. Uh, uh, one star because the graphics are too good. What? They're too, they're okay, too this, good. Th this is a five star review. Listen to this. Too much like a kid arcade. Couldn't stand it right off the bat. One star because the graphics are too good for this type of game style. Some people might like it, so I'm just speaking for myself. Sorry, uninstalling. Well, <laughs> oh, thank you, Mr. Comfort it. Crip. I missed a lot of subs. I just went on like a fucking, I went on a, like a dump truck bender. I couldn't stop reading these. I could read even more. There's so many. A lot of people have played this fucking game. Dump truck. This system is very good for the child. I'm very like all eyes. So, so many of these reviews years. are five-star reviews, years, but been. at the end they say, uninstalled, not worth the time thinking about playing this. Thank you, just that guy. Thank you. I appreciate the message. You may not believe it, but I read all of that. The, the TTS didn't read it for some reason. Five stars. Five stars, baby. Oh, man, I just we should be just doing a dump truck stream. So anyways, welcome, everybody. Uh, welcome to Wayne Reading yeah, TV. Yeah, I want to get it. I'm all about education. I want to get an education. Teach me about forklifts, you know? Mm -hmm. We actually just, uh, before before I undefined for you, we watched a very informative video about forklifts. Uh, taught us all about it. Taught us about the overcarriage. Taught us about the battery in the back that serves as a counterweight. Taught us about the fact that forklifts can go up and down slow and fast. Can we watch it again? Mm. We can watch it again after the first game. We got two games well, today, so during really the intermission. Fast. What? This play, but really fast. Two times speed? Like eight times speed. Okay, well, no, YouTube doesn't have that. The fastest I can do is uh, oh. two times speed. But we can, we, can, we can do that, I guess, if you really want it. Weezer. Fort Core! <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. Damn, this looks so cool. Why don't forklifts move twice as fast in real life? They can move some of these speeds. Like the up and down, that you can match that speed. What do you call that melody? That melody has to have a name. It's so generic. It's used in like the most basic of music. That has to have a name. Any music theory people in chat? Blues walk? Walking baseline? Goof troop melody? Choo choo? Walking dice? It's called Forklift Boogie. Oh, this is you're you're saying that's the original? Oh, bar blues. Look at that. Look at all the music theory masters we have in chat. I would never know that. I can't take this anymore. Why did you do this to me, Bob? I can. I can. You. I. The, we've ruined. We've ruined the Forklift Boogie for me. I can't listen to that anymore. All right. Uh, Thank you. That sucks. Slow it down by 0.25 for Fork Wave. Okay. Yeah. You know. Maybe that'll be better. Maybe that'll what be better. What the hell was that forklift music? Uh, it was forklift music. One brings forks, one brings the lifts. This isn't music anymore. Matt Pat? AVGN? What are you people talking about? It's been 18 for what? Certified <laughs> what? Months. I don't know, what? someone just said Matt Pat. The other person said AVGN. Point seventy five. I'm kind of liking this, though. He's a known streamer. He lives on 123 Flower Street. When he's lifting and carrying it so that it doesn't slip off. He doesn't want anything to come tumbling down while he's lifting it to the top of this big store. <laughs> okay, all right, get this, get this shit out of here. 
Get this shit out of here for good. For good. No more forklift boogie, okay? I'm done. Alright? No more. Me, please, please, <sighs> hey. Thank you, the real floss. The real floss with the real sub. So, anyways, a more formal introduction. Hello, everybody. If you're just tuning in, this is Forklift Friday. Uh, today, I'm going to be showing you guys two games. Uh, one of which is new-ish. It was actually featured. Unfortunately, I've been interrupted by the forklift boogie. No I'm not putting it back. It I'm not putting Set it back. It down, uh, I'm playing two games. Around. One of them is slightly... Re it's more recent. Uh, it's called Best Forklift... Oh my god. Did I not install... Yes, I installed it. It's called Best Forklift Operator. Uh, it, is a, it is a VR title. Uh, and it is going to train us in vivid, uh, accurate detail how to operate a forklift. Uh, it's it's a virtual reality forklift slim. It's got all the controls. It's got all three levers. It's got a pedal. It's going to be a good time. Um, I don't know how I'm going to do in this. I've never driven a forklift. I've worked one job where forklifts were like on the ground. Uh, and at the time, I wasn't old enough to use them. You had to be 18 to use a forklift to get certified. I was only 17 when I worked that job. Uh, so I've never been certified. I ain't certified. And that's going to have bearing on the... Uh, on the presentation I give you today of this forklift. But after that, we're playing a different game called You're forklift, not forklift Certified? Forklift Load. Forklift That's the whole point forklift. of the stream. If I was Forklift Certified, this stream wouldn't be any fun. Well, I hope that changes. I'm here to learn. If you went to school, but you knew everything they were teaching you, what's the fucking point, you know? To uh, dunk on everyone that's stupid. No, that's not how school works. You would get bullied. <gasps> no, no you'd just what? be smarter. I, what? Oh, oh geez, no! Happy. Account alert. June 10, 2022, a product code you registered has been revoked from your account by the publisher. Davi go for beta, beta testing. Fuck. I was meaning Fuck. to play that again What's soon. Why'd they revoke list? it? Is the game out? Hold on. Okay. It might be out. I'm, I'm going off topic, but I need to look and see if that's like, if it's coming out soon, because I was dying to play that game again. No, it's not out. Why'd you take it from me? I'm sorry I never played it. Oh, that game was so good. Okay, that, that's off topic. But the second game we're playing is called Forklift Load, uh, which is a, it's a platformer where you play as a forklift. And it, I, I think it's going to be good. You the best. I think it's going to be good. If you want to see what it looks like, look up Forklift Load, or just, you know, wait for the surprise. I think it's going to be good. Uh, thank you, Forktailed Fox. Okay, so, our first game is a VR game. So we're going to get into VR. Uh, so give me a few minutes here, and we're going to get started. Thank you to everybody who subbed. Thank you for the 500% hype train, level 5, standard package, thank you. time for dark burgers. Oh, I thought right you were now. calling the hype train a standard package. No, that's someone's name. <laughs> <laughs> So anyways, we got Gur and Balp on deck. Say hello to them. We forklifting in here. Hi. Water. Water. Oh, hey, I'm just going to say this now. In case you hate forklifts so much that you have to leave, tune in tomorrow early. It's Saturday, and I'm going to be streaming early, baby. Like 2 or 3 p.m. Eastern, yeah, I'm going live. I'm and we're playing brand new game, not even Please. out yet. Rumbleverse. It's a fucking wrestling battle royale, and I promise oh, you, that yeah. sounds even cooler than it sounds. Like that, that game is cooler than it sounds. It is so Hello, good. It's so fucking good. You can suplex people off of skyscrapers, and it's it's a free beta. So if you have a game store, you can all play with me. Uh, but yeah, all right, I gotta go to the Make VR room. Sure check if Forklift game was made by Jim. Thank you, Ty. That's how you know if it's legit. Y'all, he's not kidding about that excitement. Besides Elden Ring, this is his most anticipated game of the year. I can't wait to get Forklift certified. Subscribe to me, please. Please subscribe to me. Please, 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 please. Why so serious? Subscribe to me, please. Please subscribe to me. Please, 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 please. I used to be forklift certified, but my certification ran out. Terry, some really funny training videos out there on YouTube. Subscribe to me, please. Am I just, am I forklift certified? I was powerlift certified. Well, fabulous me, aha, which is kind of the same right. thing. Please, 
It's a it's a forklift power jack, pallet jack. Yeah, it was a pallet jack, not power jack. Pallet jack, same difference. It's a forklift you don't ride. Forklift fun cam. One this sec, sped up version sounds like we are done. Subscribe to me, please. Please, 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 please. Pork lift. <laughs> Subscribe to me, please. Please subscribe to me. Hi Wayne, it's my birthday today. Can I get a shout out to make all my friends at the old people's home jealous? Subscribe to me, please. Please subscribe to me. Please, please, please. Forklifting is impossible if you think about it. Subscribe to me, please. Please subscribe to me. Please, 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 please. Forklift night. Subscribe to me, please. Please, 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 please. Fork, yeah. Hello? Ugh. Gerd and Balp, can you hear me? Please. Yeah. yeah. Alright, good. There was a little confusion about my setup, but I think it's fine. Hey! Chat! Hey. <laughs> Whew, virtual reality. Haven't been here in uh, a week. When did we play for one? That was like how many days ago? A week, it's about a week ago. That was a week ago. It was last wow. Friday, right? Wow. I think so. Yeah, it was last Friday. Wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ooh. Wow. Ooh. Wow. So, welcome everybody. Wow. It's Forklift Friday. Watch wow. this. Wow. 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 Someone's excited. Wow. Somebody, one of the donators, wow. is going crazy. Wow. 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 It's a boulder bash. Wow. Wow. Yahoo. Wow. Wow. Yo. Wow. Whoa. What's happening? Oh, fucking headset it's just got it's fucky on me for a loading, second. It's loading all the forklift data. <laughs> I'll have to get a side stream up for you guys in a second here, but right now the game is booting up. So our first game of the night, best forklift operator. This is where the real training is going to be done. I'm going to be the best forklift operator there ever was. The best, the best, and there it is. The best. Our baby. Oh, is this forklift music? Is this real forklift music? Wow, this is what this warehouse does. We just move forklifts. We don't we don't sell anything. We don't store anything. We are just the best forklift operators. You can't even hire us. We just spend our whole day just having fun in the warehouse. Just doing like... I hope this game isn't yeah. just like learn how to use a forklift. I hope we get to a point where it's like we're doing like tricks. We're like drifting and dropping pallets into places. Like, I want to go What's crazy. What's better than this? Just guys being dudes. Can I turn down the music, please? It's a little bit too loud for me. I'm so excited That's better. to see some certified forklifting. Huh? All right, graphics are medium. Game looks fine to me right now. I see no reason to turn those up. Uh, give me a quick second here. I need to go in the Discord. It's not working. Hold on. That means I have to go back to the other room. Fuck me. Bye. Gianni may trade no reference to you on stream earlier today. I thought that was pretty Back cool. Back on the floor again. Subscribe to me, please. Please subscribe to me. Please, 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 please. Forklift time. Yippee. Subscribe to me, please. Please, 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 please. What's so hard about lifting a fork? Sorry, me up my a big fork? official forklift nap. Side stream up, side stream look good. Yep. You can see the forklift before me. Uh, actually, it doesn't look. Oh, yeah, it's okay. Yeah, I mean, it's it's se it's seven twenty p thirty. It doesn't. We don't. This this Discord isn't boosted, so we can't do higher. 
Do you want to play tutorial? Yeah, I have no idea how to drive a forklift. I love to play tutorial. Loading. You gotta learn. Who gotta the learn. Fuck are you? Forklifts are all about loading. <laughs> that looks like. How do I? Is there a button to reset the uh, the height? I'm not sitting in a chair. Hold on. Sit on the floor. But I don't think that's gonna work. <laughs> this is like child <laughs> forklift <laughs> operation. You <laughs> gotta start from a young age. <laughs> this is how I'm gonna do it. But what, hands on the pedals. Welcome to the tutorial mode. Before you become the best forklift operator, you have to know how to steer a forklift. Decline. <laughs> <laughs> Get the fuck. Nah, out I don't. Here. I don't need to be good at this. <laughs> uh. Oh, we can like. We have to like buy new forklifts. Yo. <laughs> It's like fucking Need for Speed. What the fuck nice. is this one? This is like an this is like an army forklift. It's armored. Um, how do I go back? I want to see. I thought I saw a button for controls. Yeah, okay. Controller VR. Press is set position. Hold is reset. Acceleration. Brake. Grab. Okay. Well, career. Wait, how do I get back to the tutorial? Oh fuck it. We don't need no don't training. Figure it out. We don't need no training. I'm already the best forklift operator. Uh, cash, $500 for unloading the trailer. Bonus for delivering all pallets and completing the tasks within eight minutes. Maximum five collisions. Okay, eight minutes. Eight minutes to show the world that I'm the best. All right. You ran over six people with your forklift. <laughs> You're fired. Too many casualties for day one. If it was just five, you would have been good. Here we go. All right, this is where I'm meant to be now. I do feel a little bit too tall. My head is poking through. Three percent of forklifters partake in the yeah, that's not safe. on the job, which is when they eat peas while working. I don't know what you're talking about. I could decline this too. For starters, a simple task: you have to unload the trailers and put the pallets in the proper places. Aim the forks only at the pallet, not at the side of the truck. Uh, that goes without saying, bro. Already, you didn't teach me how to drive. Yo, I got a rear view mirror. Can't see myself in it. You declined to be taught how to drive. That's <laughs> not how you use a steering wheel. That kind of is. All right. So I have not used a forklift before, chat. But I have used a pallet jack, which is a similar concept. All right. Now, how do I lift? Ooh. You are not the guy. How do I reverse? What? How do I? I don't understand. Do I just slap these? Oh no. Oh no. Okay, I get it. Oh, what the fuck? Chat's gone. God damn it. I have to leave the room again. All right, hold on a sec. You're, you're fired for this one for sure. Chad, I'd like you to picture in your mind, if you will, a man trying to learn how to drive a, a forklift, fails, immediately gets out of the forklift, and then lies down on the floor. <laughs> I'm upset. It's, it's hard to do this. Oh, I fucked it up. First job. Fuck. You know, I don't even think I have to lift this pallet that we're on specifically, is the thing. Reset me. Reset me. What? I can't reset anymore. Do, are you you are you only allowed one reset? Hold on. Let's let's go back to the main menu. I want to turn on the sound effects too. Chat were the sound effects really really loud? Happy twenty two moths of fungus. Hmm. They weren't. Like the reverse sound, it was blowing my eardrums. I'm gonna turn it down regardless. Oh, that's weird. Just a bit. Career. Play. Level one. Begin. I know exactly how to approach this. Okay. Please reset me. Actually, this is a this is a more proper height. I am a little bit like like the chair isn't making sense here, but I'm too tall for this tiny ass forklift. Um alright, accept. Alright. Um, let's go. So we need to unload that truck. Uh I don't know. 
if I just need to get my, uh, get the shit in here and then put it on the shelves or if I could just put it on the ground. All right. So, our first pallet. Fork it. Is this gonna, is this gonna work? Oh god, I'm pushing it all around. Hold on, we gotta reverse. The controls here do not make any human sense. Uh, in order to accelerate, I must lift my hand in the air so I'm not touching the R button, and then I pull the trigger. Which does not match any of my knowledge of how to drive a car. Uh, grip the... Line it up! Line it up! What the hell? They don't fit! Lower it. Oh, is it too high? Oh shit, uh oh. Wrong direction. Oh, it's... The game is oh, lagging oh, like bro. hell. I... Oh, what did I do? Oh shit. Hold on. I don't want to break the cargo. Was it too... Was it too high? Oh, it was! Okay. Yeah. Alright, got it in there. Is this allowed? Lean that shit back. We got it. We got it. We got it. No, reverse, reverse. What? What is this control? It's pretty bad, I'll say. <gasps> oh my god, it's wa it's rocking. <laughs> we're okay, we're okay. That tutorial, huh? Oh! <laughs> shit! Why is this here? I have to get that out of the way first. <gasps> down, down. Oh, it's really sensitive. Well, now you're moving oh well, no, I have to, off. I have to, I have to put it back in the truck first. This loading bay is really bad. Yeah, it's terrible. Well, I mean, it's more so just the, the fact that that somebody put a box in front of it. There's I don't know whose great idea was that. Dude on the last put it down. shift. Hello. Oh my god, the gripping is so bad. Grab that. Oh, 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 no collision. Easy, easy. No collision. No, I gotta go fast. I only have eight minutes. No collide. Can I drift? Ooh! Oh, that was really good, but it made me kind of dizzy. Just push it a little bit. We can scrape against the floor. That's totally okay. Nobody gives a shit what a warehouse floor looks like. Just don't do it on the, uh... Showroom floor. Well, I'm not going. Who takes a forklift onto the showroom floor? Ah! What was that? Something in my in my room just. Okay, no. No ghosts. I heard that. You did. I think it, it was, was a ghost. Yeah. It was like a box fell down or something. It was for something I bought for a future stream that's just sitting in here. Uh, stop. Drop the box. Go go down. Tilt. Full release. Nice, 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 nice. This game is making me dizzy very quickly. Check this out. Oh, whip the wheel! Whip the wheel! Oh! Oh, that was so close! Oh! Hold on. A, l a little reverse. A little reverse. Slap the green flo floating drive button. And here we go. Uh, we only got eight minutes. How many boxes do we have in here? Like five? I think it's about five. Woo! I love this job. I'm watching and I'm getting dizzy. All right, we gotta lift up high. Forklifts can go real high and they lean back. It has a it has a marked area for that. What? It does? Oh shit! Wait, I have to put it in sideways? Oh fuck that. Waste of my time. Who's my manager? I don't know. You need to kick their ass. Stupid decisions. The box can go in either way. It would help if I knew what this was, but they don't tell me that. Reverse, 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 reverse. Okay, so we gotta rotate it. Hey, where's the timer? I have only three minutes left. How are you supposed to do this in eight minutes? 
on my first day on the job and they want me to unload an entire truck in eight minutes. What is this, fucking Amazon? All right, uh, yes. lift it. Lift it. I need to lean it back. Lift it up. But I put, I, I put that there, didn't I? Fuck me. Oh my god. Oh god, oh fuck, I'm taking it with me. Well, now that's in the way. Lift that up. Do a little rotation. Drop it down. All the way. We good? Someone in the nope. someone in the chat is right. It, this is easier in real life. <laughs> I don't know if you like if you don't know how to do it. This is my first time ever using one. But in real life, you don't have the struggle of like gripping, like trying to grab something and your hand just phasing through it. That doesn't happen. Oh no, boss! Sorry, I dropped this pallet. My hand phased through my steering wheel. You know, it doesn't seem like there's any. Uh, do I have any collisions? No. It doesn't seem like you lose any points for being rough with your cargo. I think I probably could have just used the other box to, like, br like blunt force the other one out of there. Just brute strength it, like, psh, knock it to the side. Probably. Uh, mm, reverse. Drop. Lift. What? Oh shit! Uh -oh. oh shit, uh -oh. it's hooked uh -oh. on the thing! Oh! oh yeah, for sure. <laughs> Call OSHA! I need OSHA! I need OSHA now! <laughs> Alright, reverse a little bit. Drop it in a corner somewhere. Actually, yeah, I need to get it the fuck out of the way. Oh, so that it doesn't, doesn't block. You have like a minute. I mean, that's. I think the eight minute timer is just to get maximum money. I think. I think if I go over eight minutes, it still counts as a clear. I just don't get all my five hundred dollars. I will say, if I was a forklift operator and my boss was paying me five hundred dollars to unload a truck in eight minutes, that's pretty fucking good pay for like anybody. Yeah, you'd get 500 bucks because you'd get it done in, like, four. No, I'd take my time. I'd take my time as much as I could. You as know? long as these boxes aren't actually filled with bombs. Here we go. Oh, boss is going to be so proud. In the green zone. Let's lower it. Yeah! Yay! Woo! Uh-oh. No, no. No, no. All right, so we got to be real gentle. Oh, you're getting bonus points. <laughs> I, it's so hard to... It's such a sweet spot. Get down there. Can I back out now? Woo, we did it. Yeah. Let's do some celebratory donuts. <laughs> One collision. No, that was one pallet. You're good on collision still. Oh, oh wait, you're right. Oh wait, that's one. That's eight minutes per box. Oh no, wait, you went. No, you're not. Time. I'm over time. You're wrong. Thank you for the donation. One time, a forklift driver fucked up and spilled half a pallet of strawberries on the floor, and then just left me to clean them up on my own. Oh, did you get to eat some? I could go for a strawberry. What's your favorite fruit? Uh, I like strawberries, but I got them growing on my lawn, so I'm set. What? That's fucking dope. Yeah, <laughs> it's awesome. And they're good? They're quality? They're growing right? I, they, they vary. They're really tiny, but so you have to get like a whole bunch, but it just means you throw a handful of strawberries in your mouth all at once. All right, so this one I do put on long ways, so we don't even have to rotate it. I'm a little bit worried about that box, but who cares? I'm overtime anyway. They're already firing me. I might as well break all their shit. <laughs> well, I'm already fired. I might as well just rack up more points in the opposite direction. <laughs> Ooh. Uh, probably not up to code. I was like lifting the forklift and shit. Like, look at this. You can go crazy. 
We're doing tricks. Can I flip it? Can I flip it? Oh, that, that makes me sick. No, no, no. Where's good? Stop, 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 stop. I think I damaged the... It's like glowing red. Uh, How do we get out of this one? <laughs> you lifted it out of existence. No, it's still up there. It's, it's like you broke the laws of physics. Yeah, I don't know what's happening. Hold on, let's, is gonna be super pissed. Let's have an analysis of the of the situation. We can we can get out and we can look at it. Yeah. Um so the wheels are stuck on that box up there. Uh -huh. And then I've got the what they call this. We had a name for this in the forklift boogie. God damn it, do we have to watch the forklift boogie again? Oh I see okay. what you mean! See, I see I see there's <laughs> your problem right there. What the fuck? You How do you do that? Explaining that one to the boss. Does this does this forklift have no limits? Can we go even higher? No, that's as high as we can go. Yeah, don't get crazy. C can I get out of this? I think you're fucked. Hold on, let's just reverse. You need another fork. Come on! Why didn't they train me? Why did they let me decline? Them, no. no, but here's the thing. I declined to be trained, and they still hired me. Like, I think oh, this okay. is on you them. Must be a genius. Chat, is this on them or me? Is this on them or me? I think it's on them. They should not have let me do this. It's not on me. They should have fired me. <laughs> I think it was well, they're going to. Good news. Boss. They left me alone here. What do I do? Modern hydraulics aren't strong enough to save me. Wait, wait, wait. I think we're on the right track. Oh shit, I'm fucking it up even more. I don't even know how you got into this situation. I'm fucking putting the pedal to the metal. Come on! Get out and push. Is this stream certified? <laughs> At the moment, it's absolutely not. <laughs> It is not forklift certified. God damn it. There's no way out. There there was no way out of that. We we'd have to call the fucking fire department for that. Okay. All right, this time we know what to do. We I think we we might be able to get the 8 minutes. <laughs> Taking the cargo to heaven with you. Yeah, shitty cargo to take to heaven with me considering it was just like a bunch of copper wire. All right. So the base paycheck is $500, but we get a $500 bonus if we do all that shit. This is $1,000 in, in five minutes. That's crazy. Okay, so first things first, we got to move these out of the way. Thanks for the sub. Uh, Minty Malamute, thank you. It's $1,000. There's a reason people always, uh, people gloat Check about shit being forklift certified. Oh, shit. Did that count as a collision? Nope. I think you could nope. just be as rough as you fucking want with these extra, with these, like, not important boxes. I think you could just fucking launch them. Yeah, get out of the fucking way. Let's go. Forklift no, speed runs. Get the shelf, the shelf, the shelf, the shelf. What? Oh, yeah, what there is one the on the shelf? way. I forgot yeah, about that. Yeah, yeah. No, you know what? I'm going to brute force that one, too. I have a plan. All right, fuck it. All right, drop the, drop that. Drop that ass. Not an ass. <laughs> it's a forklift. First of all, not an ass. First of all, forklift. Okay. All right, watch this shit. You ready? Watch this. We're gonna we're gonna whip it. Whoopsh! Whoopsh! Get the fuck out of here! Yeah! Woo! Unloading. <laughs> let's go. Let's get the rest of them. Full speed. That was a collision for sure. Nope. What? Nope. Boss loves me. <laughs> <laughs> Boss is real. Uh, I bring him a ice cold. I bring him a fridge cold Coke every day, and he loves it. Oh, fridge cold. Fridge Even cold. Better. Fuck all this shit. Man, I hate it when the boss plays favorites to get people like you driving around. <laughs> I don't know why he likes me. I make this place infinitely harder to run. 
<laughs> the coke is not enough. Oh, you know what? It's because I'm bringing him that that classic Coca-Cola. You know what I mean? Vintage. Vintage. Let's go drag this shit. Red means good. Red means bread. As Wait. You get that bread. It looks fine now. I don't think I did. I don't think I even did any damage to it. Although it's kind of in a bad way here. You just hook it and drag it to the right, the left. Hey, mods, if you're not already doing a bet, you should do a bet. Does Wayne complete the first level? I think that's a very safe bet. For which side? I'm not telling. Oh. No, no, what are you doing? Hook the, hook the front. No, because it's like behind the pillar thing. Yeah. You, like, push it to this... To the no, line. watch! I got it. Oh, what the fuck? That's not reverse. Easy! There you go. All right. Okay. Okay. I'll give it up. It's a little bit high. A little bit. <laughs> a little bit high. A little bit. Oh, <laughs> Too many drinks before work. Whoa. You just need one more. Hair on the dog. Oh, this isn't the right one. Check this shit out. Angled. Angled. Wait a minute. Where do I put this one? If not here. This does. I don't think this is where I'm supposed to put it. No, that's not it either. Is it just because it's off kilter, or, or did I break it? I don't know. That's the first... Is that even the right okay, box? Okay, that one's too small. It's definitely not the right box for this one. But it, it doesn't look like it fits that one either. Hold up. Get off the hook! God, I'm just imagining seeing this actually happen. <laughs> Someone would be dead. Someone <laughs> would die. Because I would not be the only one in the warehouse. Yeah. Woohoo! Yeah! Yeah! It's like four in the morning, <laughs> nobody else is around. Woohoo! I love my job. I'm getting paid 500 bucks for this shit. Fuck them up! Let's go! Dude's about six Heinekens in. Full speed or you're a bitch! Mmm! <laughs> <laughs> yeah! Full extra points! Mmm! Mmm! Reverse! 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 reverse. reverse. Six reverse. collisions! <laughs> well, nine months. Crisscross! Crisscross! Okay. <laughs> no, I just I'm not I'm never getting that out of there. No. Hey, thanks for this job. Subscribe to me, please. Please. I don't subscribe. like that look he's giving you now. <laughs> it's the same look, bro. You think he's alive? He's a picture. <laughs> a picture of perfection. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? What did that person say? My fucking uh, grips. Whoa. I'm gonna feel my grip. What the fuck? You can use those? Uh, why can't why can you uh, do that? No, it's a, it's a trick. Watch, I can do it with my mind, too. Oh, okay. That was good. I thought they just, for no reason, let you hit the pedal. I should play like that, though. Baby mode. Look, forklift driving so easy, a baby could do it. A baby could do it. I am that baby. I want to be the baby. Is that all the way low? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Don't uh -oh, be a brat. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Come on, don't no whining box. You know what? Someone brings up a good idea. This should have multiplayer. Oh, that would be so good. That would make this way more fun. <laughs> That's how we do it. Why'd the box turn brown when I beat it up? Alright, fuck this brown? shit. Brown? Going for max damage. 
Forklift! Crush! Crush! There you go. I'm going up! Higher! God damn it, I wish the back wheels would work whenever you're stuck like this. Because they're touching the ground, probably. Or maybe they're just I, not. I don't think they are. Oh. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, baby! Give me a raise! <laughs> I'm the sickest forklift driver there ever was. Yo, check this out. I call this square peg circle hole. Okay, that was nothing. I thought, like, I thought shit was gonna fuck out. I, I want to see the physics in this game fucking, like, become annihilated. I bet it can happen. All now right. I'm imagining the, the guy that's, like, driving this truck. All he can hear is, like, a huge crash and someone in the back going, Oh, God, give me a ring. <laughs> uh, mm, I want to clip through the wall. Yeah! Fools, why am I in reverse? We're not going reverse. Come on, that's gotta break the roof. I know trucks' roofs are not that strong. It's not, this shit could break right through it. Okay, all right. Yeah, you ever seen uh, that bridge? All right, he just gave me a a notice. I'm two strikes away from being fired, so I, I have to do my job. Oh, my, he took my passions. I loved this life. Hold on, I need to reposition. How do I do it, though? The game was never clear about that. I thought, okay, there we go. All right, so we're gonna ignore the boxes. I think that's one like like haphazard strategy that is totally legit. I don't think there's any tr any problem with that. Lower. Oh my god, I wish these worked better. They well, they work fine. It's just grabbing them feels awful. See that rearview mirror? Yeah! Woo! Oh, that counts as two collisions. Okay, well, those are my two. You'll manage. I was too busy hanging out with the golden lion tumblers. Go ahead, just get that out of the way. Well, That's I hope you're making that money. Thanks for tuning in. And thank you for the support. Enjoy the zoo. I'd work at a zoo. I'd work at a warehouse. I would work at a zoo, too. That would be fun. Sadly, I don't think we're ever going to get any multi-forklift levels, but I have no idea. I think the game expected me by this point to be done with this. And I'm still on this level. So, we're going to be a good little forklift driver. We're going to be certified. We're going to do a great job. Oh my god, did I just do it? Woo! Hell yeah, not even a struggle getting out of there. That rules. Alright. I'm getting it. I think I could do this quickly now. How much? We got six minutes left? Easy. This is going to be a blast. A cinch. I was told I would not work at a zoo. A kid got his foot... What is that? A kid got his foot stuck in a rope tunnel in the kid's zoo, and he had to call the security to get him out. That sucks. I'd still work there. Oh, hey, the cargo's different. These are like... These are like... What is this? Haritos? I think it's Haritos. They could be if you want them to be. <laughs> they mm, got the right go colors. Is it Haritos or Yaritos? Uh, or Jaritos. I thought it was Haritos, but I don't know. <gasps> is that a collision? It was a Haritos. Haritos? Oh, people saying Haritos. All right, so I've been calling it the right thing. I, I feel like at some point someone corrected me and I disagreed with them. It didn't sound right. I think that's probably why I got mixed up. Mm, I feel like I heard mm, mm, oh, damn it. All right, so I'm this just poke it. Just gentle, poke it. a gentle forklift poke. I've seen these forks uh, spike through walls and impale people, but soda should be fine. Doritos uh, and Haritos depends on where you learn Spanish. Okay, I can. Oh, really? That. I could totally believe that. Yes. There, there you go. No! <laughs> <laughs> Fuck! Oh, what do sorry, you mean? You one more millimeter, I'm gonna have to dock your pay. What do you mean, boss? Oh, fuck this, we'll do it the real way. Uh-oh, uh-oh. 
Uh oh, are you making it work? Reverse! Making sure it's the right height when it's on a shelf is really hard. Nice! Okay, a little lift. Would it be possible to make Drag it to the right. movie where the characters don't violate OSHA regulations? An action movie? Well, can they really- can an action movie- can they violate OSHA regulations if they were never, like, in a place where OSHA had jurisdiction in the first place? Like, if an action movie took place in a forest, OSHA doesn't do shit in the forest. OSHA comes up to some bears, tells them their cave is unsafe, they're gonna get eaten. Yeah, that's All right. God's territory. No, that's the bear's territory. Bears don't answer to God. Oh, oh yeah, the Heinekens. Excuse me. It's not easy to keep straight. Oh, no, the Heinekens. Oh. I'm up to three beers on my lunch break. Um. <laughs> <laughs> You know, I think playing this game, I, I have a I have a strong drive to play this game and listen to the King of the Hill theme theme on loop. I feel like that'd be a lot of fun. <laughs> the theme of the working man. Don't lift me. All right, this this one's a hard one. How much time we got left? Three minutes. <gasps> yes, yes, yes! Woo! That Fuck yes, one. sir! Fuck yes, sir! Mmm, drop that shit. Oh yeah, I don't think I, I... I didn't talk about this at all yet. Last night, I don't know if you saw it, chat, or not, but I was on the, uh, the Polygonathon 2022 charity stream with Scorpy. It went really well. I hope you guys were there. During our block, though, we raised like $10,000 in those two hours alone, so that was hell of a turnout from you guys. But there's no way everyone was there. More soda! 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 <laughs> it was a lot of fun. Yeah, that went great. Oh, shit! I can't look at chat, because it'll, it'll, it'll spin the steering wheel around 180, and I'll lose my collision bonus. All right, where does this one go? I see it. Oh, Target locked. Yo, this is the first fucking AR forklift. We got like holographic screens in the view. I bet, I bet using AR would help with a forklift. Pro I mean, AR like the industrial, the the industrial applications of AR are fucking crazy. Like, there's so many things that they could use it for that would just make like a warehouse job ten times easier. It's true. No, no, drop it. Oh, the, you can see it. It's so hard to, like... It's so finicky. Yeah, where you're not lifting the forklift. Okay, you're no, good. No, you no, no, good. no, I'm not good. I'm not good. I'm lifting. <laughs> Pull it back. Oh. No, no, no. There you We're good. Go. We got one minute. One minute. <laughs> oh shit, you got two No, that didn't count as any collisions. The, the two collisions were at the start. No, I mean you got two things in the truck. I know, maybe three. There might be something behind that other one. No, you're, you're at four out of six. Oh shit. Don't touch the steering wheel. No hands, ma! I could do this, I could do this, I could do this, I could do this, I got one minute, one minute. This would be a good media share game. Ugh. It really it's too would. late for that. Ugh. Drop. No time for that, go Tilt. Can I get out? I think I gotta lift it some more. Holy shit! Damn it! Oh, I just missed the eight minute mark. Oh, and there was only oh. one left. Okay, that was still pretty good, though. $750 right. is still pretty good. Well, I have to not crash four times while getting this last box. 
Somehow and this, I think you'll manage. This is the biggest box of all, though. You got it. And it's up against the wall. That's the other thing. That could make it a lot harder to crash. Uh, in. Lit, wait, push close. We wanna, we wanna hug it. We want, wanna make physical contact. Tilt back. Oh god. Oh shit, we are right up there. Turning here does not wanna happen. Oh no, I'm not grinding yet. This ain't a flying Dutchman situation. You're good. You're good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. No collisions. Clean. No, all right. Turned on. No collide. I'm not cheating. This was all legit. <gasps> Ooh. Ah! Oh. Oh. You could no. Pick it up from the, <clears throat> the left. Pick oh, you think? You think? <laughs> yeah. All right. Ugh. This game's hurting my wrist for some reason. I'm gripping the fucking. I'm 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 gripping the wheel for dear life. I don't know if this is gonna be possible. I don't think I can get the the thing under there. There's not enough space. Okay. And then then pick pick up the the forks and put them on the very edge of the pallet and then try to like like tip it. I don't think that's see gonna what, work. You see what I mean? That that'll work. Street no, like don't don't lift it up. You press down. Oh maybe. You see what I'm saying? That could also just deal insane damage to whatever this is. It's already fucked. How often do you see a box? Uh-oh. Well, maybe Yeah, I don't know if it's going to work. Ah. Yep. Make, Hold on, make let me contact get... and then like turn right. Yeah. I I think if you are even a like an inch off the ground, the game will not let you move your forklift. Chat, do you have any ideas? How often do you see a box? There's one in this room. It scared me earlier. Fail streamer cannot operate heavy machinery. Look at what I did! I just made one mistake! Oh shit, there's like a... You have like fuel. I didn't even notice that. I didn't either. Lift the left side. You can't. You can't get the forks under. You don't know that. I tried! It's cool this company has a policy where my boss isn't allowed to help me. Also, this would probably just be doable if we just had someone, like, touch it with their hands. All right. Lift here, it like an inch. Here's my other idea. Yeah, just like just a little bit. Like, like two people absolutely could do it. I'm going to try and see if we can't do something like this. Just a little lift. Squeeze it in there. See, this is going to flip it the other way, but I have an idea. If you can get it pressed up, I can get it on box. the other box. Here we go. Okay, okay, okay. Wait, I think it broke. What do you mean it broke? It broke. No. Look at your objectives. Okay, well, how do I. Job's done. Job's done. Thanks, boss. <laughs> we didn't need that fridge anyway. Job's done. No, you're not. You're Pallets not delivered. Your Five out of tomorrow. six. I got all, I got most of my money. Four hundred seventeen bucks for less than twelve minutes of work. We didn't get the bonus though because we didn't get all the pallets. Damn. Wait, what the fuck is that meter? Do I have to earn that much? Kids that, are eating bread tonight. Four hundred seventeen bucks. They can get more than bread. We unlocked mission two. We won. Okay, this one gives me a thousand dollars. How different is it going to be though? Kids are I have seen the inside tonight. of your locker. Maybe tidying up the warehouse will teach you how to keep it clean. What the fuck is your problem? Kiss revoked. Unkiss. Unkissed, bitch. I didn't know how to make a reverse smooch sound. Oh, okay. So this time we don't even have to fuck with the truck. This one's easier and it pays way better. I can't. It's impossible. God, this fucking music sounds like it would be playing in a forklift instructional video. Like a modern forklift workplace yeah, yeah. training video. It's when perfect. operating the forklift, make sure there's no one in your path. Make sure not to break the box. Be sure not to flip the box upside down. Your forklift can kill a man. Don't do that. We can fire you whenever we want. Nope. We have a union. We can fire you whenever we want. <laughs> <laughs> the, 
They could probably, here's the thing, they could probably fire me. Yeah. Not everybody, but me. <laughs> I'm not we even certified. You whenever they, we want. When they realize that they made a mistake and they let the guy who didn't even have training do this, I think they can fire me. You know, in the end, chat, I'm glad I didn't. I, I, I'm glad I declined the training. Yeah. Because that was end, time wasted. Yeah, I learned everything I needed to. Because it turns out forklifts real simple. Fall by fire. Yeah. Forklifts you easy. Fall. You had to fall to lose it all. How much time did it say I have for this mission? Was it another eight minute one? Oh, fuck if I know. I was too busy laughing and making jokes. Well, maybe maybe don't do that. Maybe take this seriously. <sighs> Dad, you should take your own advice, bitch. I am taking this seriously. Uh, reverse. Oh. Line that up. Line it up real good. Yeah, you're not a, I'm not lined you know, up. You know real forklift driver. Wait, do I have to rotate this? I think I have to. I think they want me to rotate it. Make, Hold on. Make jokes about this job you take so unseriously. Yeah, I need to rotate this one. I hate when they make me do this. Well, actually, I guess that they didn't make me do anything. Your boss makes you drive this. <laughs> Reverse. Reverse. Any boxes behind me? Nope. See, this time I can't just crash into boxes willy-nilly because I think every box that's in play is important in some way. Oh, look at that perfect turn. Maybe not so perfect, but good enough. The pallet we can beat up all we want. They're meant to take a beating. It's true. You ever seen like a well-used pallet? Those things are like, those things are hazards. Did Bob already say what he had for dinner? I'm not allowed. Bob doesn't do that on these streams. It's a long, it's a long running condition at this point where Balp only says what he has for dinner on his own streams. That's classified. And that's Balp's decision. That's not me. That's classified info. Oh, yeah. You got to fly to flag if you want to know that info. What? You got to fly to flag. Is there a, is there a dinner flag? No, the Balp flag. What did Gur have for dinner? Which one's All next? about that. Haven't had it yet. I, no, I, I had the, I had my dinner. It was a bowl of ramen, except when I tried to put uh, dried uh, green onion in it. Oh yeah, that's right. Yeah. I, I thought it was a shaker bottle, but I forgot that it's not a shaker bottle. It's just straight open top. So I dumped about half a cup of green onion into it. Oh, this palate's making me thirsty. I want to drink all these bottles. They may or may not be water. I don't know. But it's but seeing blue jugs like that just makes me crave. Oh, I want the tallest glass of water right now. Oh, I went. They don't, they don't let me have water on the job. No. If I if I'm you gotta get to management for that. Water cooler. I know. Even, I know. <laughs> I know. You could probably I get know. one now. What? You could probably afford a water cooler. They're not that pricey. But, like okay, a simple water cooler. Device, you want like a crazy I, one? The physical device isn't pricey, but you want to know what is pricey. The oh, constantly getting models. the jugs. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Just refill them. I gotta flip this one too. I hate how specific they are about whether or not the thing is oriented left or right. I hate it. I hate it. Proper loading and unloading. No, it's bullshit. What? It goes either way. It, if if I genuinely worked this job and they were getting mad at me for that, I'd be like, "Fuck you!" It's on the shelf, no, and the no, forklift can safely grab it. The pallet supports weight differently when it's grabbed by a, a, a lift. What are you talking the, about? It went up there just fine. You can't yeah, argue you, with that. You, guys, you can't you argue this with job that. Seriously. This Fuck. is. You see how it's long ways? How it's it's got more support this way? Oh, who cares about that? <laughs> These things are built to be foolproof. They work either way. I know that for a fact. There's a reason they have openings on either side. Uh. The side ones are just for turning. They're for lifting, baby. I got certified. No, you didn't. I got power. I got. That's power. not even remotely the same. The, the, those are the same. The difference. That's like saying I learned how to ride a bike, and then you tell the cop that when you get pulled over driving your car when you're not licensed. I got a certificate. Here's my bike license, officer. That's not. Here's a video of me with training wheels. Without training wheels. Look, the only difference between those high power 
uh, jacks and a forklift is you drive the forklift. Yeah, and that makes a world of difference. Oh shit, I got two more minutes for two more pallets. I can do this, I can do this, I can do this. Focus, focus. How did that happen? Oh, that's some bullshit. When did that even happen? Fuck this. It's, it's not like that by default. Mm, 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 mm. Battery, bitch, take me to court. <sighs> <laughs> I'll get you, bitch. This game is hurting my hands. It's probably also because I've been playing a lot of Tekken lately. But some, like something about gripping the fucking wheel in this game is hurting me. I, uh, you know, after like two years, three years with the index controllers, I'm, I don't like them anymore. Like they're, they're better than the Vive ones, but they're not good enough. They need to iterate again. The, the grips are so fucking annoying to use they're so finicky if your palms even sweat a little bit they are it's just hell to use i don't like them anymore that the that finger tracking is still nice but a you issue i've never had a problem with sweat your palms don't sweat not as much as yours do apparently i mean mine sweat a normal liked. amount but it's enough that like a slight amount of moisture on the controllers makes them Maybe. so hard to grip and ungrip Maybe you need some like moisture whisking like fingers, so, gloves or something. The plan was, uh, they, it apparently works if you put tennis tape, like tennis racket tape, on the uh, on the controllers directly. And I bought some of really? it. I don't know where it is though. Yeah, I need to do that before the next big VR thing. I uh, would I would try the gloves too. Uh, lift. Gloves could work. Get those, like, the paddling gloves, you know what I mean? Mm hmm Are you fu- No, no, no! I hate forklifts. The stream was bad. Get out! Okay. Free. Drop it. Drop it low. High speed. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. It's fine. Uh -oh. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. They taught me to do that. I had that black market training. Oh, I'm having an Austin Powers moment. You're having an Austin Powers moment. God damn it. <laughs> All right, just back up straight. Uh -oh. One collision. One collision, two collision, three collision, four. Okay, this is the worst part of this game. This yeah, is a I terrible see that. system. It's terrible. It's like I hit drive, time to grab the wheel, and it does that. Like, boom, boom. Wait, what the fuck was that? I just. Game Where's the camera? I quit! You need to get a better forklift! There's the camera, hold on. Every employee has to know where the cameras are so they can hey! secretly steal. Check this shit out! Fuck you! I'm, I'm leaving! No two weeks notice! This is the two minute notice! Where's my- ugh. I'm gonna break this shit. 85% health? Not for long. Take me away! Driver! Go! <laughs> Drive me! Take me home! Alright, I can't even I break this stupid thing. Best forklift operator! Here's my review chat. This would be a good game if you like driving forklifts. <laughs> Which I don't. This We're gonna play the platformer game? now. I'm fully ready. I'm trained. Let's go. Let's go. Oh fuck, he left us on the truck!
Let's do the forklift boogie. Lift it up, set it down, back it up, turn around. Forklift boogie. Yeah. Oh shit, my name. Let's all do the forklift boogie. Back and forth and up and down. For a job like pallet moving, a better truck cannot be found. Oh, see how high he lifts this crate up, then so gently pulls his blades. He doesn't want anything to break up. That's just how a forklift's made. So do the forklift boogie. Lift it up, set it down, back it up. So his forks can fit through without any difficulty. Watch as this truck driver gets to line them up almost perfectly. All forklifts work in warehouses and construction sites and lumber yards. There you'll see large stacks of pallets. You won't have to look too hard to do the forklift boogie. Lift it up, set it down, back it up, turn around. Forklifts are made for lifting really heavy loads. The load sits on the forks, which can also be called the blades. These blades are attached to a part called the carriage. And forklifts can lift their loads really high thanks to this part, called the mast. It lifts the carriage and the forks way up high. It can go slow. Fast. I didn't expect Whatever to it come takes back to do to it right. The driver usually tilts the load back when he's lifting and carrying it so that it doesn't slip off. He doesn't want anything to come tumbling down while he's lifting it to the top of this big storage rack. You won't see any other truck quite like a forklift. So do the forklift boogie. Lift it up. Set it down. Back it up. Turn around. Forklift boogie. Such heavy loads that he has to have a counterweight in back. This is so he won't tip. What do you mean I didn't do any of this? It's a battery pack. And what are you talking about? I saw the video too. I used all of these techniques. It protects the driver as he delivers his load in the lumber yard. You know what else protects the driver while he delivers his load? What would that be? A seatbelt. Uh, have a seat belt? Welcome back. Folks, next game. Does a forklift have a seatbelt? I bet. Right. Do forklifts have no seatbelts? They don't look like they do. I don't Maybe think they, they do, do either. Do they, not they... Go, do they not go fast enough? No, I'm not Why resuming the video. I'm done, okay? We're done with forklift boogie. I gave you most of it, okay? Look, we're not even on the right this BRB screen. It needs to say that. Forklifts do have seatbelts. There you go. The joke works. <laughs> the joke works. All right, I gotta launch this other game. Make sure my controller is being received in it. This game does not support VR. I will close it. What a so, chat. What do you think of that game? <laughs> Good. Good. The first message I see is like screaming. Good. <laughs> All right, so the game was bad. Did you enjoy watching it for... We were barely even in there for an hour. That was... Like, if I want to do that, I'll just go apply for a job. Why did you play it? Because it's Forklift Friday. And also, because if I didn't play it, then this yeah, next game was going to be too hard. It's Forklift Friday. We do this every single week. I've done... Yeah, this is like the 60th one. And I somehow don't know how to use a forklift yet. Uh, play Forklift Load. So this game is by a developer that is apparently notorious for making like really decent small games uh, that I think are I think they're supposed to be really challenging. Let me let me look at their. Uh... Oh yeah, also this game is I think it's like I think it's gonna be really emotional. I think we might cry. Emotional? Yeah, look at this. Hold up. I think y'all are gonna like this. Cry.
Oh my god. What? It's so emotional. Yeah, Jack can't see it yet. But they will. I'm trying to fix my camera. It's like falling over. Ugh. I got a question for you. Question for me? Yeah. Little old me? Yeah, little old you. What? What's the What's the latest in the day you would drink coffee? Like, 4 p.m. maybe, if I had to. Oh. I could. <laughs> I don't think I would. Uh, I have no limit. I have... Like, especially if I'm, like, hanging out with friends and I, like, need to stay up. I've had coffee as late as, like, midnight before. Here's the thing. Here's the thing, bitch. Whoa! I probably, I, well, here, the reason I say that is because, Valve, you're sounding cocky. You need to get humbled. I think... <laughs> I think, hey, everybody, hi, this is Forklift Load. New game out. Uh, actually, it's not new. It came out in 2020, it looks like. But you can see what I was talking about, that this game might be emotional. I think I think we're gonna feel something today. Oh, hold on. I have to. I need to take a drink, but I need to do something first. Oh, hold on. We need a color source. Black. Black color. In the chat. Oh. I can't let them see this. This is this is my shame. Damn it, I know. Where is it? Where's it coming up? You better censor that shit before you put your mouth on it. Alright, there we go. Sorry, I'm gonna have to do that every time I take a sip of that drink. Alright, so this is uh work with load. You never did own Balp. What the hell is this intro? This is not how I thought. I thought we were just oh, going to be Oh, so it's Stanley with. Parable. Okay. I'm an AI robotics engineer and researcher. I'm in the midst of developing a whole new environmental adaptive AI. I listen to this music all the time during development. Listening to this music helps me work better. It's decades old, but I've been listening to this music for a long time. The music player is also quite old. Magnetic tape audio player. Even though it broke down, I used it while repairing it. It's probably the only one that exists today. That old. Very old. Let's get back to the point. When this AI is perfected, it will be possible to automate all the production activities that humans currently do using AI. Then we'll be able to do only what we like and enjoy doing, and our lives will be far richer. Eagle! Fork forklift anime? Maybe? I don't know a lot about this game. I just know it's supposed to be good. Oh my god, there's characters. I didn't realize oh, there would be characters. Oh, sir! Oh, sir! Oh, sir! Oh, sir. Yes, Suddenly sir. you were forced to shut down and stop working, and then you didn't start for three days. I worried you so much, but I'm so glad you got it rebooted successfully. Let's get right to work today. First of all, can you hand me the drum with the fuel in it? When I give it to you, please step back slowly so you don't drop it. Perhaps you have forgotten how to operate it. Use the escape key to open the pause menu and check it out from there. There are more features. Take a look at the pause menu. Uh, can I play this game with a controller? Oh, oh. Look at those tires! God damn, that's some torque! High what torque. the fuck? Yeah. These are like Gmod wheels! <gasps> oh whoa, fuck, this is, whoa, whoa, this is whoa, way whoa, whoa, harder than the other game! Where's her, where's her like, straps? Our tie-downs? Yeah, let me just leave a loose explosive barrel on this pallet. Uh-oh. Oh, this is so much harder. What? You can jump. What? You can <laughs> jump. <laughs> okay. Uh. Just take it. I. I don't. 
<laughs> That's it. Wait, wait. She's saying I did it. Okay, fuck, fuck. God damn it. Hold on. Sorry, I know this is annoying, but I, I'm legally obligated to not show you what this beverage is. It's not even you're good. legally obligated to show the other one? It's not even good. It's bad, even. Uh, where's our game? I don't know. Okay, where well, I have to reboot it. <laughs> so, Alright, don't fail the fucking mission! The game will just crash. Welcome back to Forklift Load. What? I can't use a controller now. And you gotta reboot the side stream. Continue. Oh, yeah, 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 right. <sighs> hey, what? Oh, it just like, uh, it, did it just let me skip to the next objective? Apparently. Whoa, we just did, we just did a fucking skip. We're, we're about to speed run this game. Hand the drum straight ahead of you here to Mr. Blue at the exit. Mr. Blue is over there. It's a bit far, so please be careful. Boy. Oh, wait, no, it's not here. Line it up. Cutthroat, it didn't even tell me how to play it. This map is literally Kill House from Call of Duty. Straight up. It, it kind of is. Wait, what is happening here? What? Oh, okay, there we go. There's a little face on the back of that forklift. Nah. I mean, I kind of oh. see it, but... No, I don't... Oh shit, hold on, now we, now we gotta push the barrels back into place. Okay, I get hey, the, 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 the AI is supposed to be so good that you don't even need to fasten down your barrels. But, it would have helped them. We got it! Oh my god, we gotta go really slowly. AI gotta... can't account for mistakes, like, let's be real. Is this here. game for real? They really want me to do this? Maybe I can lower it. What the fuck was that? Oh my god. Uh, we bumped oh. the chair. We bumped the chair. Oh. The power of AI. I'm starting to get some getting over it vibes from this game. It's going to be like that, I think. I think it's going to be something like that. All right, so lower it down. Don't touch the chair. Will we have, no, it doesn't, I was gonna say, will we have better control if we lower it? But it doesn't even seem like we do. We just have to go this slowly. Where's Mr. Blue? Is he on the other side of this fucking Call of Duty map? Yep. I think he is. Yep. Didn't you say this was a platformer? We'll get to that part. No! We won't actually get to that part. <laughs> we actually might not. I don't know. If... In the trailer for this game, you get to see like there are, there is platforming segments. Why do you think we can jump? It's a platformer. This is merely a tutorial. This is merely a prelude. So square will stop you in your tracks, but breaking hard also seems like a very good way to just lose all our barrels. We need to go this slowly. This game, this game feels like it's trying to teach me patience. If this is AI automated, why is there still a C? Because there's not new forklifts. They just installed an AI into it. Why would you waste man hours removing the seat? Lighten your load. What do you want to put there? Like a mounted gun? You don't need anything more. The forklift is a perfect device. Whether it's operated by man or without, the forklift lives on. Oh, there's a fucking obstacle. <laughs> there's a fucking tire in my way. It's gonna be fine. It's okay. <gasps> ah! 
Oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> no. Easy, easy, cowboy. Mr. Blue. Right over there. Mr. Blue. Do you have to put it like on the on the forks? I have to put it. I, I just have to give it to him. I think I think slotting it into his forks would be like an impossible task. Oh, oh, you're good. You're good. Mr. Blue. Good there job. Go. Thanks. Next time, help me out with the outside. I left the exit for you. We beat the level. We beat, we did it. Fair and square, too. New song. Oh, wait. This is the card. Civilian. Excuse me. I need your help. I'm out of fuel and I can't move. Can you please go ahead and bring the fuel to me? On the way here, I found fuel. What? Why didn't you put it in? I guess you can't do that. He doesn't have any hands. Don't be. Got to extract it from the barrel. Oh, and this time there's no pallet. Oh shit. Actually, maybe that'll make it easier because maybe I won't have to like. Maybe I can drop it and it won't immediately like cancel me out of the mission. Oh no! It oh, is on a pallet. pallet. It is on a pallet. Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah, of course it has to be on a pallet. If it falls off the pallet, it's useless. We have to throw it away. Jesus Christ. <laughs> what a shame. <laughs> I don't know if I've ever made any a noise like that in my life. <laughs> I nearly saved it. We were that close to uh, to saving it. So yeah, you, you got pretty like, chimpish. You, you see that you can like climb over the thing there. Does it does it actually expect me to do that? It's like like an absurd challenge. I kind of want to try it. This is the first fork type type game. Man, I can't Yo, crawl, but I kind of want to run. If you played as a forklift in Death Stranding 2, I would be so into it. That'd be a day one purchase. A forklift voiced by Norman Reedus. Fork-like. It's not over yet! you anymore. You know, we're, we're in a future where forklifts are so smart they can talk, but the car isn't electric. Why? <laughs> it does not, that doesn't make <laughs> any true. sense. AI is easier than making a battery. I wonder when the hell this game is going to expect us to jump. You know, I noticed when we jump, it's like the, uh, the lift has like a little bit of suspension. I wonder if, if we can at some point, safely jump while carrying something. Okay, line it up perfectly. Perfect. This music is so nice. Barrel get. All right. Uh oh. We're good. We're good. Those pallets are just jealous. Don't worry. They'll never be carried like a forklift like me. Think you should be going this fast? Yeah! Yeah! I, I had to see. I had to figure it out. I had to see if we could maybe do it. I was good for a while, but I gotta be really slow on those ramps. Back to our 
destination. They didn't program Never this forklift. Never been to Forklift Friday yet. That's right. Chat, if, you, yeah. if you're at this, what the hell yeah. am I doing? Yeah, if you're, if you're here, you're we're getting in on the forklift. ground floor. You may know if it's one, ever. <laughs> <laughs> hey, if you can find me more forklift games that are as yeah. interesting as forklift load, I'll play them. Check this shit out. Bam! Oh! What the fuck were you trying to even do? I was trying to... I was trying to, like, just reorient it, but I used a little bit too much force. People are saying the music is too loud? It's not that loud. I'll turn it down, though. Is that better? Is that too soft? I feel like no. it, it might have been louder on this stage. I, I was really scared that was going to close the game. Is there a forklift in Grand Tour Adventure? I don't know. You know, the only Ooh. other forklift game that I can think of is Shenmue. That, would, that I would actually, like, want to play. So you know what? 24-hour Shenmue stream, we'll do it on a Friday. Cringe chat? Why? Because they don't know any forklift games? Cringe. Fake forklift fans. Fake forklift girl. Becky over here doesn't know a forklift game. To be honest, I'm a fake forklift fan. Like, if you asked me some weird specialized forklift fact, I couldn't tell you shit. And I've seen the forklift boogie. Is Wilmot's Warehouse a forklift game? I don't think so. That's the game where you, like, organize shapes, right? <laughs> I think you organize shapes in that one. Hey, Jill Jig! Thanks for the big 22 months. Does Sonic and Sega All-Stars Racing count since Ryo Hazuki drives a forklift? He doesn't drive a forklift. Does he drive a forklift? I thought he drove, like, an arcade machine. And we, pretty we sure that's that an arcade machine, guys. Yeah, he doesn't drive a forklift. Oh, you mean in the original one? We're thinking of uh, All-Stars Racing Transformed. He doesn't drive a forklift in that. What a missed opportunity. All right, here's your gas. What are you gonna do, suck it through the air? Oh, he does drive a forklift in the first game, okay. That's funny, why did That's they change that? That's kind of a shame that? that they took that out. Oh, you brought it, thank you so much. You saved my life. Now I can go home. Wait, you were gonna die? But I need to get back to the city. But the roads are blocked with debris. Is there a wheel loader somewhere that can move the debris? Look at the map with the M key. Go to the mm, mark. Go to the uh, 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 mark. Uh, just a little bit of excitement. Uh. Hey, you know what? Fuck you. Oh, you're stabbing him. Die. Jump on him. I'm gonna Stop break it. your windshield, bitch! Stop <laughs> it, Uh-oh, whoa. You're killing the citizen? The yeah, he's not an EV. He doesn't deserve life. Actually, I think the whole point of this game, if you couldn't tell already, I think all humans are dead, so I actually don't know if it's that important that uh, he's an electric vehicle. I think it might be too late. Who needs a wheel loader when you've got a fork? Oh damn! That nearly busted my whole machine. <laughs> Just went. Ah, ah. All right. Well, how do we get over there? Oh, I see. Is that the Cars universe came to be? I'll tell you what. As soon as that car talked to me, the first thing that popped into my mind was Cars. But like, how could that not be the first thing that pops into your mind? You know. Whoa! Big brother! Hmm, what's going on? Can't get through with all that debris? Alright, I'll take care of it. I'll get rid of the rubble in a minute. I still have some work to do, so I'm sorry. But in the meantime, can you get me some fuel? It takes a lot of fuel to clear the debris. You're just an errand boy. Pretty much. But I've got to save the world. Sometimes you gotta do errands for the greater good. 
forklift, same as the world. But here's the thing, you call me an errand boy, but like, I'm a sentient forklift. I fucking live for this. Like, in this forklift's mind, it's like he's picking up these barrels and he's probably thinking like, yeah, woo! He's having a blast. Oh, so chat, here's where the platforming comes in. Here's where this shit comes Gun in. Gun it. I'm not gonna be able to gun it when I have a fucking barrel in my hands. Gun it. Thank you, Wolf Beasel. Hold on, alerts are too quiet right now. I gotta turn them up. I cannot hear them. Uh, and I wanna check that last alert. Someone said something. When I was seven, my dad drove a forklift for work and let me ride. To this day, my brothers have never forgave my dad for not bringing them. Oh, I I was reading that and expecting that to go another way. I thought you were going to say my brothers never forgive me for what I did on that forklift. I thought you, like, killed your dad <laughs> or something. <laughs> uh, okay. All right. We're going to use the wall to get it on there deep. Lift it up high. All right, so this is, I think this is our first real challenge. Getting over this ramp with the barrel intact. I'm just gonna go ahead and press against the wall and get our load in there deep. Place your bets, chat. Mods, make a bet. Can I do it first time, first try? Actually, wait, you might not need to do it. I think I might be able to get out over here. Oh no, there's no exit. Place your bet. He doesn't know. He doesn't know that no one's open to bet. Does that mean we have no mods? I'm talking to two mods in the voice call right now. I'm busy. What, what are you busy doing? You're watching. I'm watch. Yeah. Type in the chat if you love trucks. I'm, I'm, touching, I'm touching cards. All right, fuck it. No bet. You're making all the gamblers in chat sad. Yeah, we're making all the want, gamblers sad. Okay, okay, okay I'll wait, I'll wait, I'll wait, I'll wait, I'll wait. I see it there. Hurry up. You want me to, all right, you want me to be real? I don't know how to start a bet. Really? Really. You've never done it in your own chat? It's like, nope. it's an amazing Twitch feature. Everybody else does it for me. I love trucks. Why is everyone saying uh, that? Did we get raided? Um, Where are we well, all right, someone already did it. So many people are saying, I love trucks. You told us to? Did I? When did I say that? Okay. <laughs> you must Hold on, no. Okay, sometimes chat when I'm streaming, I kind of go into like a fugue state and I just say things. Did I say like, tell me if you like trucks? Is that what I said? What did I say? Put it. Check it out. I focused on the game. Type in chat if you love trucks. When did I say that? I was like, <laughs> to be fair, I'm right here and I didn't catch that either. I just spat it out. I just <laughs> clip it, clip it, clip it, clip it and link it. You got to be a sub to link it. One day I'll fix that. I've been saying that for years. <laughs> <laughs> Show me that clip. I'm waiting. I'm waiting. The clippers, the clippers are working hot. Their keyboards are clacking. Their their mouse are clicking. We must clear this ramp on the first try. I'm gonna do it. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna do it. The mice are clicking. The hands are shaking. The hands I, I, are this shaking. This is so important to me clicking. because I literally I have zero memory of saying anything like this. I'm waiting for the clip. There it is. There it is. I don't need to. You just have to hear it. I'm not gonna put it on screen. Watching. I'm watch. Yeah. Type in the chat yeah. if you love. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with me? I don't remember that. At Early all. onset I'm... dementia. Woo! Let's go. Let's do the ramp. Type in the chat if you love dementia. <laughs> I think I was gonna say like if you love gambling. No! Oh! Enjoy your points. I was careful, man. I don't know how you do that. Do you think we need to lift it up high? Or, or maybe we have to put it in the middle and then drive over. That's probably what you have to do. I don't think you can get over the ramp without dropping it. You have to place the pallet down. You're right. You're right. I didn't think to do that. <laughs> in the chat, if you love trucks. Can you tilt the forks at all? I've been pressing all the buttons. I know how to jump. I know how to lift. 
This AI is so dumb, it doesn't know how to tilt no, its own forks. No, you can't forks. tilt the forks. It would be way easier if you could tilt you them. You can see the mechanic on it to do that, too. Well, this is like a model they got off a Unity store. Hold on. What does this mean? Oh, that's from the intro. Can I see, like, controls or something? Maybe there is a way to do it, and I'm, like, not seeing it at all. Uh... Oh, no. No, there is no way. Press equals switching. Maybe? Oh! Alright, we got different camera angles. That could help. But yeah, no, it's just up and down. This is a uh, remedial forklift. I like the over-the-shoulder view on a fucking forklift. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Don't drive your forklift like that. <laughs> Shit will go wrong. The world will vanish before your eyes. Woo! Uh oh Uh-oh. Jump! This is why we can jump. Whoa! Hold on, check this shit out. Woo! Oh, oh my god, this forklift's crazy! I really want to see a speedrun of this. Honestly, me too. I'm not good enough yet to do it myself, but maybe one day I'll be. When you, when you give you know, up, you should load up a speedrun on stream. I'm not the biggest streamer, but I think I'm big enough that if I like actually put in an effort to getting good at speedrunning this, I could I could get a slot at AGDQ. I would totally do that. That would be so much fun. Right now, this seems like a game I could not speedrun. The, the, uh, the balancing act here is just something I'm fundamentally not good at. All right, so we, ha we have to put the pallet in the middle and then drive over. Remember, this, this game really is all about teaching you patience. Yeah, that would it would be your second time at HGQ. What are you talking about? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that would be second, your second time, bro. But I didn't know how to speed run that game. I just tricked them into letting me on. You made it them was, really it mad. It was re a really stressful experience. I don't know why I did that. But <laughs> shit. <laughs> the jumping is fun, but maybe I should be careful. Okay, they, these extra angles are actually pretty damn useful. Everybody that's like confused about the AGDQ thing, just go to YouTube and search Wayne. Yeah, Radio go to my TV YouTube AGDQ. channel. If you don't know what I'm talking about, you haven't seen every vid on my YouTube channel. And shame on you for fake fucking <laughs> fan. <laughs> no, there's. There's videos on my YouTube channel that you don't need to watch. I have no, I, I would I would not suggest that you watch my some of my Fallout 4 videos. I didn't really know what I was doing when I made those. They are so dirty. You know what's fucked up? Is I forgot that I was getting that downright that. raunch sexual in those vids. It was fucked up. I'm surprised I'm not banned. I think you're gonna have the opposite of it. I think people are gonna watch those. Don't watch them. You can watch the baby one? That's the only one I really have fond memories of. The others are all just kind of there. People watched them yeah. back then. I don't know. And if you like them, I'm not going to dunk on you. But to me, it's like those videos are just so gross. Like, I, the, the Vive mic was so shitty. The footage was terrible. Like, the, the, the quality, it looks so bad. All right. So is it, oh, wait, so what is was the Yu-Gi-Oh one? It was all right. Huh? I think that should be enough. I still love the Yu-Gi-Oh video. Like, every video I made after those Fallout videos, I think everything beyond that is pretty damn good. I think that should be enough. Let's clear some debris. Wait for it. I made a video about the R6 game, and that is my favorite video I've ever made. I'm not even joking when I say that. It's that easy. That's how we're getting through. If you want to get to the city, you're gonna have to go through there. Goodbye, big brother. Poblano. Peppers. <laughs> Still review a forklift. Wait, how are we gonna? Oh yeah, it's free. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm liking this game. This game is way better than the other one. Do you have to visit the car first? Uh, no, I don't think so. It looks like we just go over there. Actually, let me press M. Maybe the car has a secret mission for me. Nope. Wait, what? <laughs> oh, I thought... I looked at the map, and I thought where the truck loader was, I thought that was a picture of, like, a handshake. Like, it... 
Do you see what I'm talking about? Look at the little debris no. over there in the corner. Oh, you I see it, yeah. You see, it looks kind of like a handshake. Yeah. Just vaguely. I can kind of see it. Yeah. 16 whole months happy forklift Friday. Brother check-in. Forklift brother check-in. Tonka check-in. Why it's lost in space, though? We've sent out probes. No one knows where he is. When will you unlist Bound to Mine? Well, it's already unlisted. So. Another civilian! Whoa, the world is so beautiful. I say that every day. There's the city. What? Whoa. It... Is this the next level? This whole fucking area? This is huge. Oh, oh that's it's the, the Wii that's Internet. The AI. <laughs> this is the Wii Internet HQ. They have a headquarters. Oh, title drop. Fuck yeah. That wasn't even, that was just the tutorial, guys. We got the whole world ahead of us now. Evolution Opera. Of the perfect <laughs> forklift. The first perfect automatic forklift created by AI. This will be our first step towards a happy life. Really? <laughs> All these forklifts know how to do is move gas Starts from point from A to point B, and that's gonna save the world. Starts from the bottom. Hachi. Hey, Evolution 01, I'm talking about you. Hey, hey, have you forgotten your name? The sign over there says it, so take a good look at it. You're the first machine ever built by a memorable eagle, Company AI. Next move's a little bit too slow for me. I'm having a hard time reading it naturally. I read all of that already. I have a favor to ask of you. I want you to take this to my brother in the hills. If you get lost, use the M key to look at the map. By the way, you can jump with the space bar. Okay, go for it. Whoa. Oh man, you're kidding me. That's such a long distance. Look, he's got a drift and you need to bring him his gas. Gas, gas. I wanna step on the gas. Ta -da! And be the winner. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I will say, if this game didn't have like a very intentional somber piano soundtrack, I would be listening to Initial D music mm. while playing this. But I really, I, I love the vibe this game has. Where do we need to go? I can't even tell where I am. Uh. Deliver target, deliver goal. Okay, so I need to go the direction that I'm headed. This is the right yeah. way. All right. You think I can gun it safely? I think if I, I think if I just approach the turns, speed limit 80. 80? No way. Road. If it's you go 60, you're flying <laughs> off the fucking the, corners. The next speed limit sign is like not even 100 feet away. You could go 80 for that. All right. No, of road. you know what? It's I've kilometers. actually seen that shit in, in, in the real world. It's got to be kilometers. Too. 80 miles per hour there. I've seen that shit where there's a sign. It's like, oh, you can pull 60 miles an hour through here and then about <laughs> 100 feet away, limit. it says, go 30 now, please. I keep hearing X-Files in this theme. Really? I don't hear it at all. Um, I'm getting like Breath of the Wild vibes. Right here. Okay, kind of. Those bowling pins? No, the the glow, the glow is making them look like it. They're just they're just road poles. Oh, fuck, X of the files. On this hill. Oh man, do I have enough fucking horsepower to get up this? That's a You're fucking good. crazy turn. Yeah. You, you, a million cars must have flipped on this shit before uh -oh. everyone uh -oh. died. Look uh -oh. at that. You see that? I see that. <laughs> yeah. I'm, like, I'm marveling at that awful dip in the road. What a nightmare. That's what made humanity extinct. That one turn, every single human flipped their car and died. All I can hear is fucking X-Files when it does that. A lot of deer warnings. I also see this on a pretty regular basis. 
I want to write. I, I want to. The, the next time we do like a novel AI or AI on the stream, I want to write a story about a, a just a, a single harsh turn that killed everyone on Earth. Oh, uh, that would be good. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. We're going fast. I'm, my hands are off the gas, but if we break, this shit's going flying. Okay, we're good. That was the right move. The road is sinking. You're heavy. What? You were the the road was like clipping into the dirt. <laughs> I didn't notice that at all. Maybe I noticed a lot of things. This could be near. That's the fucked up thing. See, the buildings aren't nearly overgrown enough. It looks like see right there. Yeah, I, I do see what you're talking about. <laughs> this this looks like the kind of apocalypse scenario where like humanity disappeared in a single day, like just gone. What was that game you there's played no, when you were no a dog? There's no sign of destruction. Tokyo Jungle? Yeah, this is like Tokyo Jungle, but with... Yeah, no, because uh, even there, like, the buildings are overgrown and shit. Although they did vanish true. quickly. The, the, the thing with that is, like, everyone on Earth... I, I didn't get to the lore. There's actually lore in that game that explains it, but uh, the... Everyone on Earth just vanished for some reason, or died, or something happened to them. Uh, but the reason everything's overgrown is because it's been like that for a while. Yeah. But this is like, this is like humanity just died. Or AI are just keeping really, really tender care of everything. Oh god. <gasps> oh shit. Should I just let it, should I just let it go? I think I should, yeah. Alright, now start slowing no down. No lands. No, it's good, the hill will do it. Okay, but now I have to put this down on kind of the slope. Go. Oh, you're the one who carried it. Hachi are causing me trouble again. I'm sorry. Thanks, man. Oh, by the way, there's a guy down the road who's in trouble, and you might be able to help him. Why don't you go there and see if you can help? Okay. Where? Oh my god, there's a lot of missions. This is open world. Open world forklift game. <laughs> Fuck yes. I'm gonna be real, chat. When I bought this game, this is a game I wishlisted like a year ago, and I did not reread the description. So when I called this a platformer, I may have been misremembering. But there absolutely is a platforming segment because I did not, I did not like conjure the memory of the platforming segment. It absolutely is in this game somewhere. Hello, I'm here. Look at my condition. It's completely sandwiched in between. Isn't it amazing? I can't get out of my own. So please help me. This is Isn't it amazing. This is fucking written like road trip adventure. It's very similar. Look at me, am I, aren't I amazing? I'm so cool, go outside and take five pictures of windmills. Okay. You gotta I read this dialogue like it's fucking Speed Racer. It's cause it, it's, it's just paced like that naturally. Oh, oh God. Don't worry, citizen. Oh <laughs> shit. I'll clip through the ground. Oh, I'm gonna kill him. He's gonna die. <laughs> It's okay. It's okay. You're okay. We're okay. Forklift. I'm not driver. moving until I'm where I want to be. Why do you need to be rotated? Are you out of gas too? You know what? That's probably what I have to do. I bet after I put him in position, he's going to be like, I need some gas. Can you go drive across the entire world? And get me a specific... Please, please get me some gas. Can I get some gas? God, you're so big. Grasp it. I've never lifted a big boy like you. What? Whoa. You're a lifesaver. <laughs> ah! What? <laughs> Rest in peace, Sedan B. It was all a dream. <laughs> all right, there's another mission down the road. GM Big City is looking great. This! This is what I saw. In your dreams? Maybe. No, I saw it on the store page. It says there's a mission here, but... Oh, you came at the right time! I need you to come up here to help me with something! 
and bring any fuel cans you may have left on the way. There's a clipboard pickup next to it. That's lore. Oh my god. Oh, this is gonna be something. This shouldn't be too hard. Nah, you got this. My Run faith is, is squarely in your hands. Oh my god. It's fine. You just have to... Uh, there we go. Oh! Oh! Oh, I'm on a fire hydrant! Ah! Ah! There we go. It's a good thing we don't, I don't have health. If you could actually die in this game, it would be uh, a little bit harder. Alright, I gotta line it up good. How did that even happen? I was doing perfect. Alright. Uh, I jinxed you. You kind of did, though. Uh, See, that's the thing, is I hold that power. And you abuse it. You misuse it. Oh, yes. And you're a bad friend. Yeah. Damn. <laughs> Disclaimer, I love my friends. Oh, shit. Uh-oh. Oh, good save. Whoa. 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 Oh, easy. Turn the engine off. The power, the power went crazy there for a sec. We're good. Oh, this turn is tight. Fully intentional. All part of the plan. You know, after I bring him the fuel can, I wonder what he's gonna have me do. And he said he. I, I'm not just bringing him the fuel can. That's like extra. Oh, this is gonna suck. Grab it and then back up. Yeah, what the fuck else am I gonna do? Run off the edge? Of course I'm gonna back up. No, I mean, go up the ramp in reverse. You think? I think. I don't think. No, that'll that'll make the barrel more likely to fall off. I want the the, the upwards angle. You're just scared. I can do this. Just take it slow. to see this. I think it was left behind by the humans who created us. It's just curious. I'm sure there are others. We need oh, to maybe find the people them. are gone. They are gone. Alright, the barrel no longer matters. You can just push it out of the way. Uh, or no, not. I can't. It's made of fucking steel. Okay, I, that means I am in a, a genuinely precarious situation. What I'm gonna do is put the forks up high, and then I don't have to worry about space. Or time. Right, Both are an illusion. This AI system, formerly called the Environmentally Adaptive Genius Learning Engine, that's a terrible name, or Eagle, is the main difference between this AI system and the self-learning AI of the past. The major difference between this system and the self-learning AI of the past is that it can actively learn and acquire necessary information from the surrounding environment. In this way, the system simply operates and receives information from all kinds of sensors and automatically develops its intelligence. It's a learning method that is no different from that of humans. The difference is that the learning speed far surpasses that of humans. Okay. So I the AI is smart. That. So the AI is self-aware. What? What do you mean, what? I've never heard of such a thing. Guess what, guys? This is Half-Life 2. You gonna do a stunt? Yeah, let's go! Self-aware! 
I love that. I love how it reorients itself. It's like we're in water and it's floating. House like self writing. There's too many heads on. Blah, blah, blah. I won't spark it. I'll just put it in my pocket and save it like rocket fuel. Till everybody is gone and it's cool and I spark it up with my blood is my man named him Mola. Thank you for that. Check it out. I'm in the house like carpet. Muscle P. You there. Yes, you. It's in a back alley at the end of the street. What? Don't let me tell you this anymore. Come on, come on. Just go and get it. What the fuck are you talking? What is this? You selling drugs, Muscle P? You selling car drugs? You had to go on the other side. No, I'm going to jump in. There you Easy, go. Easy. No. Easy. <laughs> Dope! Oh, that was awesome! Oh, that was so cool. I love that, like, the torque maintains. Like, it, like the, the wheel will stay powered while you're jumping like that. That was so cool. Easy. Oh, this might be hard. So what is like an illegal substance for cars? Nitrous. What would they, you know what it yeah, is? That's literally the answer. They love that shit. Oh God, oh my God. What? Oh no. Hey, if, you, if, you, if, you, if you're careful, you can come back for it. Hold on. See, here's the thing, I have to jump. Fuck. That was almost really cool. But they almost all stayed in place. You're like getting glued the, to the walls. It was like getting stuck underneath the guardrail or something. All right, I need to make sure this shit is aligned immaculately. But that doesn't happen anymore. Oh, they, they like intentionally misaligned this pallet so that you would have to that you can't just go up it and then go back down it. <gasps> oh. oh, one of those, one of those barrels is rowdy. One barrel is so close to tipping. Muscle P. Almost. <gasps> oh my god. Oh, we did it. We did it. Take it. Oh, you're good. You know, we don't get good gas mileage, do we? That's why I get hungry. Thank you for bringing it to me. Just <laughs> fucking. <laughs> you hungry, bro? You acted like that was like a special dark gas or something. Hold up. Why do we see oh, you a know. marker on that building? Was there another path I could take going up there? Doesn't look like it. There's like a there's a clipboard or something up there. Okay, there's no reason for me to go back there. Maybe you jump off from the building that you stunted off of. 
No, see? Oh, maybe. Well, shit. Okay, I guess I have to try that. I want to 100% this game. I'm motivated. I need to see the truth. <laughs> Where did all the humans go? Why are forklifts so important? Okay, well, I'm not gonna do it. Off to a great start. Not gonna do it like that. Whoa! I just went. That was like way faster than I've ever gone. You get a speed boost after you reorient? You get a motivation boost. Yeah, it, learned from, it learns from its surroundings and it knows that that's fucking sick, so the forklift gets excited. God damn it. Oh, I hate being a forklift. What? I wish they put my AI into a cool sports car. Instead, I just have to move gas around all day for all the sports cars. You know, there's like, there's like a, like a, they're saying something about class here. Like, I'm just a lowly forklift. These cars are bossing me around. It's not right. They're not even paying me. But also, Why I'm a forklift, they? and I fucking love to do this. Like, I get, I get one thought of doubt, and immediately the, my forklift brain just says, Nah, man, keep moving those pallets. Why would a forklift pay, buy with money? Oh, pain. <laughs> Maybe better forks? Upgrades, bro. Candy? Oh god, why the, what the fuck was that flashback? <laughs> I looked at chat and I looked back and the screen was just white and I was like, did I die? Why oh, did someone just say, someone just said, opioid? <laughs> 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 oh yeah, this forklift wants it. to buy some opioid. He just like collects them and looks at them, he can't use yeah. them. Here, let's move. Oh fuck yeah! Oh, that was sick! but resistant this thing is. Oh yeah, there it is. I must be a genius. Uh-oh. 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 Life is no good for a forklift right now. Hold on. Chat, we haven't finished this yet, but how do you think this game shapes up against Metal Gear Solid 5? <laughs> Uh, perfect. I developed Great. a self-driving system for passenger cars. This was my first project with Eagle. After a few test drives in the test bed, the system was immediately put on the road. After just one night of letting it drive around the city automatically, it was learning a complete map of the city to the millimeter. And of course, it was it was able to accurately and safely avoid passing other cars. It was an unparalleled achievement. Okay. Now, how did every human die? Oh fuck yeah, that was sick. Double demon fang. Damn, I must be a forklift. Right, Double forklift time. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> well, there's another car. I guess I should talk to him. I hope the twist of why the humans are gone is like insane. Uh, chat, what do you think it is? What, what, why, what do you think killed all the humans? Jealousy. Capitalism, climate change. See, those, those are the obvious picks. I think that might be what it is, but I want it to be like some Aliens. absolutely insane shit. Like the forklifts gored everyone to death. Oh my, you are such a cute little boy. Why? <laughs> Will you help me? That one's really high up there. Can you get it? Yeah, this forklift is clearly a male. Forklift dimorphism. Oh my god, they actually need me to jump now.
Chat. You wanna know something fucked up? I have to do another Tory boss stream. Oh god, uh, no. Are you gonna give context? I lost a bet. God what damn it. Uh-oh. What? What? <laughs> what? I bet that Mushba and the item label folks could not win a delicious stick. And I told them if they want a delicious stick, they need to show me, and if they win it, I'll win it too. So, pretty s- But they cheated! Sometimes- they didn't cheat? How'd they cheat? No, they didn't cheat. They got- You have the good They got the delicious concept. stick they fair and square. Lucky. They got lucky. Didn't yeah, they have so someone come and grab it for them? I have to but do- But they them do that if they see you having trouble. Like, that's legal. Oh, they do that for anyone? Like- yeah, like, like, okay. it wasn't just for them then. Because here's okay. the thing about like Japanese, like, arcades and like places like that is that, like, they will take, unlike, unlike in America, they will take pity on you. If you see, if they see you trying to grab a bag of chip prize grabber <laughs> and it's like, you still two bucks in there, it's $200 like, $200 and I can't get this bag of chips. Yeah, exactly. Like, if you still, if you're a kid and you still, dollars to try to get a bag of chips, right? Like, don't, 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 don't open up the machine and be like, you spent Please three dollars do on a bag of chips. Please don't do another Tory Boss stream again. You overpaid for this bag already. People so, saying, Wayne, know, don't do it. I'm and, sorry like, for interrupting you, Bob. For them. I saw, I saw the clip. Uh, you're not uh, interrupting. No, no power and thrill on that one. Uh, <laughs> but, um, so what I was going to say is, people telling me, no, don't do that again. It's already too late. I've, I've, I don't, I'm a man of my word. You, I told them if they could win a delicious stick, I would win a delicious stick. So yeah, now I have to win a delicious stick. Lost the bet. You know what? I uh, I won a shelf off Toriba. It is the best shelf I own. Nice. Damn. Oh, this is tricky. I am doing a like a fucking three point turn on this little square. <gasps> you know oh my what god. I will say? You know what I'll say? Those delicious sticks. They're like fifty cents each at the at the Asian grocery store. You don't know that. You don't know that. What do you mean you don't right, you know need that? To set it down. Before. You don't know that. You gotta what set you it down up there, and then you drive up before. and get it. They're pretty oh. good. Oh shit! I'm in the wrong. Hey, place. honestly, they're pretty good. Imagine. Oh wait, like, no, that'll work. And okay, imagine eating a bag of Cheetos, but instead of like regular, but instead of like a bunch of Cheetos. Yeah. They, it's like one big, like, two, like, it's a one big super two, Cheeto. Like one stack two. What is a delicious stick? It's delicious. And it's a stick. I could, I, what? I, could, I literally just described it. No, someone in chat asked. How is the hey, shelf about, good? I, stop telling me about the delicious good stick. Quality you tell shelf. me more about it. Like, everything you just told me about it is upsetting me, and I'm going to choose to forget it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't fucking tell me. I don't know what a delicious stick is, but I'm going to win it. I know it's delicious, and it's a stick. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. No, it's okay. fine. I'm okay. using actual yeah, yeah, yeah. forklift strats here. You are certified, so... I'm certified! I cleared one mission. They paid me 400 bucks for 12 minutes of forklift work. It was so good. It's amazing! Thank you! Okay. Alright. Achievement unlocked. Extend arms. Okay. Uh, we got way more documents in the city. There's so much shit out here. It's so real out here. I think we can 100% this game tonight, though. If this map is everything, like, the whole game, I think I can do it. Hold on, let's see. Do I have to do more building climbing? I wish I unlocked a nitro boost. I would love to just be able to go faster. That shit's illegal, though. What, what do you mean illegal? It's There's an illegal no substance. This was, this you don't know that. Forklifts. You don't know if there's cop cars out here looking for I haven't seen a nitro, single one. nitro dealers. I haven't seen a single one. I think forklifts are rule the land. Ow. 
Ow! 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 Right, just oh, right be between the forklift tines. I'm forklift certified IRL. You can only dream of being forklift certified. Wall. <laughs> what the fuck, bro? Damn. What the fuck? They, they kind of got your ass. I know. That's like that's, a, that's such an intense way to say that. You can only dream of being certified. Can you pay like without without me working a job where I need to do a forklift? Can I just get forklift certified? Could I stream I think, that? I, I think why you can't. I probably could. I have an IRL stream bet kit that I've never used. I've had it and I've been waiting for the right thing to use it. I could stream myself getting the certification. Change music, please. This is the song of the game. This is this is where I'm experiencing forklift load as intended. The game will change music when it's time. After the success of the self-driving systems in passenger cars, all taxis were replaced with self-driving systems in just six months. A few years later, all cars from private cars to buses and transport trucks were replaced by self-driving systems. Okay. I want... I'm waiting for the juicy one. All these developer notes are so simple. I could have guessed all of this. You know, that really does look like a face, and it looks like he's got lower teeth. Yeah. He's got a... He's got quite the grit. He needs to go to the dentist. All right, where to next, forklift? Let's get the next note. It's over here. No, you don't actually need to do a practical test to get forklift certification. Oh, what? You just have to buy it? Or you just have to take the course and then you're certified. There is no, like, exam? Yeah, it's probably just a safety thing where where you're you're told how to do it right, and then you're when you oh, say, well, all right, I get it. That's exciting. Yeah. Oh, my God. I have to get up these stairs? How the fuck? Raise your rate, yeah. I know. But that still, that's not enough to quite do it. Thank you, Swamp Level. Pull, pull, pull yourself up. I'm trying. Oh, wait, you know what? I wonder if that's a, like a mechanic that they want you to use. Like if we're going to have to platform in like a real level by doing that. Nope. Nah, that would be kind of cool, though. Oh, you could, we could do a high jump, though, by doing that. Can you do it onto that trash can to your left? Maybe. Uh oh, you might be in a bit of a... Oh, you're good. See, I, here's the thing, though. I think I could do it, but even if I do it, I'm not, like... I'm gonna jump high enough, but I don't have any forward momentum, see? Back up a little. Right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just the tip. Brave misunderstanding of physics. We just have to use the stairs. Or is there an easier way on the other side of the stairs? Doesn't look like it. Those look like stairs to me. This building's not forklift accessible. I <laughs> know, it's fucked up! Oh, oh, oh! We might be onto something. How about to the right? Is there anything to the right? Maybe. No. No, it's a dead end. Damn, how the fuck do you get this? Try the other stairs. Where's the wheelchair lamp? Yeah, we could we could fucking use that right now. Square gun. Thank you. See, a forklift certification series of streams would only be entertaining if there is a practical exam. If there's not, oh, that was so much easier. But the stairs don't even seem that different, so why? When I realized the potential of Eagle, I abandoned my old development methods. I got a video of an industrial heavy machine on the internet and showed it to them, literally. Then, as I suspected, Eagle itself expanded its functionality. He even searched for videos on the internet and began to learn more and more by himself. I was hooked on Eagle with an intellectual excitement that outweighed my fears. That sounds dangerous. I think you I think you wiped out humanity. I then showed him a video of forklifts killing people. <laughs> <laughs> showed him that German forklift safety video. <laughs> Actually, Eagle probably found it himself. <laughs> it's, that's a very popular video.
position up ahead as well as a clipboard. Around the corner. I wonder if they're gonna have us go up on the roof. Probably. Horribly. Oh wait, are they on the roof or are they around the corner here? Oh no, they're up there. Okay. Also, to the person who said change the music, I'm not sure how you could get annoyed by this kind of music being on for too long, considering how, like, slow and simple it is, you know? It's too ambient to, like, if, if, the, if this game's only song was, like, dun 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 and just looped, I would, I would understand you, but, oh my god, I think, okay, I think we have to do this in reverse. Yeah. Oh god, oh god. What are you doing? I'm just restarting. <laughs> yeah, that sick. That mechanic rules. I want to see, like, the equivalent of a frag bid for this game. Wayne, get your CD Nersh. license. A -P -A -C -A -C -A -A no, 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 no. I don't want to drive a semi-truck in my fucking life. The most you'll ever see me do, maybe one day I will get the fucking VR rig set up with my sim wheel and I'll stream truck simulator. I... The, the thought of driving a big fucking big rig truck in real life is terrifying. Fuck yeah. that, fuck that, fuck that. We, we've seen too many idiots in cars to, uh... Yeah, I've seen a lot of people fuck up driving those. I've seen videos of semi-truck drivers taking out an entire neighborhood's power grid in, like, one fell swoop. <laughs> just because yeah. they were a little That's stupid. Cool. That video is pretty dope. It's terrifying. <laughs> it is cool, though. <laughs> What are you doing up here, bud? Getting stoned. Yeah. Whoa, I'm showing off now. How did you make it this far? Did you see the jump booster oil on the other side here? If you can carry that thing up here, I'll raise your jump force. Oh, fuck yeah. What the Whoa, fuck? What the upgrade? hell is that? Okay, this is some space shit now. Wait, how the hell am I gonna. Okay, there are. Let's see. This is gonna be the trickiest mission yet. Jump force with Luffy. Monkey to Luffy. Monkey to Luffy. Drive the kill the kill grocer stream. This looks like a Mega Man energy tank. It does. Look at this thing. Also, it kind of looks like a pressure cooker. If I it looks like this thing could cook a little bit of rice. Rice. some yeah. real tasty rice and make me jump real high. I'll trap a demon in there. It's the pot. All right, this is uh, this is gonna be tricky. Nah, you got it. Just what? Bull you fucking horse shit. That's not how. Well, ah, yeah, uh, we're gonna be here all night, folks. Nah. You, oh wait, hey, there's a lore over there when you're yeah, done. Yeah, I know. I'll pick that up. I just, I just noticed. But I, I am a little worried that like, oh man, this is a tricky one to get into. Okay, I would wait. I would wait until last. In case I like fling off. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that might be a good idea. Oh, that might need a booster jump, actually. Oh, you know what? That's why we're getting a jump boost. This pallet has to be grit grabbed from one side or the other. It's not four sides. See? If it has the opening on either side, you can grab it either way. Whatever. Even if one way has more support, it's totally fine to do it either way. Alright, so we have to drive over these pipes while holding it. It's doable. If you do it really, really, really slowly, it's totally fine. I just have to get over the pipe. Oh! Don't know why I did that. 
That was not easy. That was the opposite of easy. <sighs> you know, if Elden Ring didn't come out this year, this might be my game of the year. Bullshit. I'm really, I'm really enjoying this. I'm not lying. This is way more fun than Best Forklift Operator. This is way more fun than Rumbleverse. Hey, that game's not out yet. It will be. Not yet. I don't think driving on a roof of the building with potentially highly flammable liquid is OSHA approved, Wayne. Hey, OSHA is dead. OSHA does not exist anymore. Fuck! Screw <laughs> 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 that shit. Uh... <laughs> I knew I was doomed. I knew I was fucking doomed there. Ocean. Ocean approved. God, I love that. I love that. That feels so good. It's not even intentional. Akira slide. Uh. Tetsuo. All right, we got this. Just an inch over the pipes. Did you want to straddle the pipe? Yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. That was my plan. Uh oh. No, I'm good. I'm good. Oh, I'm scared. I feel like I need a lot of torque to go over the pipe, and then I'm afraid that, like, as soon as I get over, it's gonna- I'm just gonna floor it by accident. Okay, so... I wonder... I, I feel like I need to put it down before I do this, but I don't see a point where I can do that. Whoa! What the hell?! Drop it. Drop it. I can't drop it! You can't just drop it off. That was bullshit. Forklift load glitch. Oh. You just lost game of the year, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> IGN's gonna I tear you a new up. one for that. I'll make sure of it. IGN couldn't make it this far. <laughs> That's true. They play the first ten minutes. They beat the the dozer and they give it a ten. Great game. This is the souls of Osha. Whoa. What? When mm. that happens, I get afraid. You, maybe you should just set it up there. That's what I'm gonna do. But what I have to do is, like, I can't just set it up there. I have to balance it on the corner. Yeah. Which is easier said than done, honestly. The corner might be a bad idea because you can't get into that uh, slot. Yeah. But then I have to. But then it's even a, a more precarious balance job. Oh, uh, you know, I could tilt it a little bit, and it would probably be fine. If I'm really gentle. Oh. There you go. Really? Damn, this thing must be very lopsided in its weight. Self-stabilizing AI in the pallet. As a fully Is it about certified moon? and battle-tested forklift driver, I am disappointed <laughs> you are operating that fork without certification. I am contacting OSHA right now. God damn it, guys. I'll get it, I'll get it, okay? I couldn't get it tonight. Who the fuck is gonna for forklift test me on a Friday night? No one. The real ones. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, that's not gonna work. Gonna... Yeah, you're gonna jump down and start over. I don't need to jump down. There is probably... I, I bet... If you understood this game's movement and the weird, like, fucked up, like, jumping torque bug, I bet I could launch this fucking thing, like, across space and time. Oh, I really fucked this one up. This is gonna be a bitch. Okay. Yeah, you're good. Why can't I see the forks? 
I can see him. No, I can see him. I don't know what the hell I'm talking about. I've been chatting you love trucks. Oh, this is gonna be hard. Where do you where do you even go from here? I gotta take a right here. No! <laughs> Shit. Whoa! The pellet just went to another world! What? I closed my eyes. I didn't see it. Oh my god. Someone clip it quick. That pallet seriously just like. I don't know. Light speed oh, you went know what? somewhere else. I can just put the pallet up here. Oh, you're right, you could. I don't have to I don't have to do two I don't have to do it twice. Don't need no upgrades for that. Alright, someone clipped it, but they got yelled at for it. I gotta fix that. That's literally been a problem since 2018, that subs can't post clip links. Alright, there it is. I don't want subs posting any links. Hold on, let me look at this really quick. fucking flying man you know what i don't know if this exists but someone needs to make a uh, an extension for obs that makes it so when i just click on a clip it'll appear on screen like as a source automatically you think someone's done that i don't know that would be really really useful because i hate uh, making a new browser source and getting the clip in there is so tedious i could do display capture but i don't like display capture what if you see some personal information all my credit cards are in a .txt document on my desktop. Are you fucking me? <laughs> Display capture is fine if you're ready for it. Like, if I just cleaned up my desktop, it would be totally fine, I think. There are some things on my desktop that you're not meant to see, chat. Definitely playing with fire. What, going on my desktop? Leaving anything on your desktop. Yeah. We have secrets oh. here at our TVs. Uh, every, every group or corporation or company has got their secrets. Our secret formula. My secret formula. I'll say, Gerd, you want to compliment and a critique? Your plankton voice is good, but it sounds like he's 80 years old. Like, no, it's like, I can't, it's like an I, old plankton voice. It's... I can't do a good plankton. I <laughs> no! really, really can't. Okay, no! Jesus, I can. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, I gotta straddle the pipe again. Oh, 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 we're good, we're good. Pipes were guiding you this whole time. Well, sort of. Is that high enough? I was gonna say. It might yeah, it yeah. Should be. Just yeah. barely. Just barely. <gasps> Go ahead and just drag that packet tad. Perfect. Oh god, I was, I was terrified that the pipes were gonna like launch my blades up into it and knock it over. Mm. What even is the goal here? I need to bring that blue jug to that truck and he's gonna upgrade yeah. my jump force. He's gonna chug that jug. My shonen jump force. Get up, get up, go on and get up. What the fuck is wrong with these planks? Wow. That worked out better than I thought it would. Yeah, I mean, if, if I don't have any cargo, I'm, I don't really have to be scared. The fucking with the cargo is the scary part. All right, our final challenge. We just have to get the pallet to him. Down. I know. I'm just getting in position first. Jump force 
was their fighting team and it uh, is already gone. Yeah. Because it was bad. They need to, if they want to do that again, they just need to give the concept to Arxis. If they want to do that again, they need to not have a horrible fucking art style. Dear God, it was media awful. property conglomerates, if you want a cool fighting game, you just pay Arc System Works, and then you're done. Or, it might or not just be a game that them. has an infinite lifespan, but it'll be a good game. It'll be decent. Yo, the new Street Fighter Six footage came out today. It looks dope. I'm like really excited. Uh, the trailers, like, like the visual style, say what you will about it, I think it looks a little silly, sometimes a little jarring. I think most of the time it looks really good, like, in action. The, the mechanics sound fucking awesome. The, the game, the game is being described by people who've played it for an hour as Street Fighter Alpha 3 with a good splash of Third Strike. The fucking, the global parries, you got fucking focus attacks, you got B-triggers, you got everything. It's gonna be really cool. I think it's gonna be great. The, and one of the newcomers they announced, uh, Jamie, is that his name? His yeah. name's Jamie, right, Val? Jamie looks dope. His fucking he has a he has this like really big uh, ponytail. And when he does this install, when he does this install, his transformation, he chugs his jug, and then his fucking ponytail explodes and his hair goes all over the place, and the hair physics looks so cool. They look they Are look so good. This? What do you think? You feel lighter, don't you? Let's try jump now. I changed the color of the wheels too, even though it's hard to see. I'll see you guys later. Let's try jump now. Damn! I hope we get more upgrades. Yeah! Oh, this might be a problem. Reverse! Six! Oh! It looks like the jump boosters are in, like, the middle of my, of my forklift. There you All go. Alright, give us some dark lore. After the completion of the automatic operation system, I started to develop an automatic operation system for industrial heavy machinery. Here I realized the potential of Eagle at the beginning of the development I had implemented the necessary functions, but Eagle learned how to extend its own functions. I can't describe the excitement I felt at that moment, but I still remember the feelings of fear that arose at the same time. Why are you scared, bro? You think you think the forklifts are gonna kill you? I fucking hope that there is some violence in this story. Forklift stuck. Please, I beg you. Oh. You're a you're a certified forklift driver. <laughs> uh, all right, we have three more documents in the city and one more mission, and then everything else is out in the field. We have one, two, three, four, five more missions. I wonder if that's the end of the game. Or if we'll have to go to another city or something. How many? There are five more missions out in this open world area. Five. Six more missions? Did I count them wrong? One, two, three, four. Oh, yeah, it is six. But I'm more concerned right now with getting the last of these documents in the city. I want the platinum trophy. Remember that a forklift of this size weighs about four to five tons. Really? Yeah, I can really? believe that. Yeah. I guess it needs to be heavy if it's gonna be lifting really heavy shit, right? Yeah. So it's like weighted in excess. What the hell did I just join? What do you mean? It's Fork of Friday. Don't you know? What the heck? This is so random. This is crazy! This guy's playing a forklift game! <laughs> Whoa! Am I on drugs? <laughs> this I guy was behind! Was That's drugs. a forklift! <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to the stream. I'm saying that every day. <laughs> I observed what Eagle would do with her own arms. He had expected it, but he was assembling one part after another that was necessary for industrial heavy machinery. After this time, Eagle no longer needed any human help at all. When I mounted the arms on Eagle, I had made Eagle's emergency stop code stronger because of the risk of Eagle revolting. If Eagle revolted against humans, it would automatically shut down without my presence. Huh. Okay, it seems like you failed. Yeah, it seems like that didn't work. I don't think it works. <laughs> Alright, going back to town. Where's my next document? Up ahead. I think it's literally up on this rise over here. 
Pants 117. Yippee! Thank you. Yippee! Never hit a blunt, then watch a Wayne stream. Yeah, I never do that. Never do that because I'll report you. You should never smoke a blunt because you will go to hell. Oh, I guess I'm in trouble. I don't know if you've ever smoked a blunt, sir. I think you've only smoked joints. You know what? You're right. I fucking got you, Master Hurt. Hey! Hey, chat! Why is that back? I thought we got rid of that! What? What is back? It's still fucking there. What the fuck? The last time I used camera, it was gone, wasn't it? Didn't I get rid of it? What, uh, you're, you're square? I no, swear. that's been there all day. I know, no, I don't mean today. I mean the last time I streamed. Uh, I only just noticed it now. The eagle arm is complete. It's a relatively simple articulated arm. However, it can also hold things and handle some minor tasks. I immediately mounted the articulated arm on eagle. Strangely enough... Strangely enough... Eagle said thank you. In retrospect, there was nothing strange about it, because at the time, Eagle would have already surpassed the intelligence level of a human being. Oh, look at it! I haven't been looking- have all these had pictures? No, this is the no, first one. No, this is the first one. one with a picture. It's so cute! It looks like a Star Wars I forgot Eagle- I forgot Eagle was like a little robot. But when did you turn me into a forklift, Dad? I used to look so cool. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. Oh my god, these self these these self-correcting mechanics are really fucky. Self-overcorrecting. Um, yeah. Hey, is that a target ball? Nice. Nice. Where's the next one? Ooh, to the left. Oh, oh we gotta climb this weird little tower. Here's your platforming. This, this is real ass platforming. Oh my god, is my jump not strong enough? Oh, damn, barely clipped it. Okay, now we gotta go backwards. How the fuck? That seems like such a big jump. You know, I'm from the opposite side. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know why that sounded uh -oh. so dismissive. I was agreeing. I was gonna be like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck yeah, yeah, yeah. Buddy. Don't tell me how to drive the forklift. I'm the one that's certified. What does that say? What? Hey, that's just a real ass phone number. They just pulled this from some parking lot somewhere. Yeah, that's a real ass <laughs> fucking phone number. <laughs> Don't yeah. call it. No! Yeah, you're not gonna get some funny forklift game like hotline. I, your tires are start spinning so fast they're blurring. <laughs> Yo, the new rims are sick. They are pretty sick. A few years, a few years later, Eagle remained firmly committed to the principles embedded in her. Humanity stopped working and was able to live their lives doing what they loved. All the automatic production systems Eagle had created kept life and health alive, and provided entertainment. Yeah, here's your entertainment. Woo! I bet. I know there's untapped no potential for, like, fucking these physics to hell. We can go to the moon. I think Eagle could do it. Uh, alright, we've got every single document in the city. I think the rest will be pretty easy to get if they're not in a city in area. City. Like Tony Hawk music? I can't disrupt the mood. We must experience this game as the developer intended it. Sad and lonely. Even if we are not alone, we are together. There are thousands of us hanging out in this chat all at once. We're the ghosts of the humans that died to this forklift that killed everyone. You are a user. Thousands? Hey, if we drop sub 1k viewers because this game sucks so hard, damn. Don't tell me the viewer count, though. I won't. Because I saw it earlier, and that means we lost over a thousand viewers from Forklift Games, and that would be hilarious. Where is... 
my objective. Dead ahead. I just gotta go really fast. 100k viewers, 60 million? Oh, I gotta, this color source is still on the screen. It's bothering me. Yeah, that's, yeah, everyone on Earth is watching the stream. <laughs> All the ghosts. 7 billion viewers. You know, I could use Inspect Element to give myself 7 billion viewers, but I don't because I'm humble. <laughs> I'm humble. We're gonna we're gonna revive all seven billion viewers. <laughs> Dude, I can't wait. For, I'm gonna use uh, cheat uh, engine I, to inflate my numbers. Can you imagine Twitch? What happened like, to you? Where there's aliens? This is like the equivalent of a of like a dead body on the side of the road. There's a stick in his engine. <laughs> Scholar S. You have you seen the golden stone? I saw a golden stone. Must be very special. I hope you can find it. Bring it to me. You can't lift something with a fork. Oh. You can roll or push it to carry it. I get it. His headlights are supposed to look like glasses. Oh, okay. Is that just a gold nugget? That's a strange sound effect. Oh no, I'm not. Uh, what is wrong with driving on the grass? Oh, I didn't think they would have something like this in this game. I think all the services would be programmed identically. Okay, it's normal now. Oh, it's so bright. Oh, should hire this man. <laughs> That's a good one. Can I not get my forks under this? It looks like I might be. It just wants you to push it. Well, this would be way easier if I push it down to the road. Oh, but there's a fucking guard ring. <laughs> fucking Frey is really excited. Calm down. I bet I could get it onto my forks. I think it might be too heavy. Too heavy. It like yeah. rolled right off. Here, here Game we go. in the system! I don't need your tips, fuck you, scholar. But this mission is nice because there's no fail state. Unless the unless there's like a kill pit we haven't seen and the rock rolls into there that. There was a cliff. There was, there was a, a cliff. cliff. Yeah. But I bet the game wouldn't fail you if, if, if it fell off that cliff. I bet it would have. So we're imagine the stream. Rich. Imagine the quality of stream we could put on if we got a gold nugget like this. We'd have so much funding. We'd make Jeff Keeley's fucking summer game fest look like a, a big joke. Gold rock. Oh, thank you. I am a scholar. I've always wanted to study <laughs> this stone. Okay. Well, you're cool. All right. Is the city cleared now? Yeah. Cool. Yep. We get to explore the countryside. I, next time some someone does something for me, I'm gonna thank them and then remind oh, them what my profession is. I'm a is. scholar. <laughs> no, oh, just thank tell you. Me I'm a scholar. Streamer. I'm a scholar. Do any road signs look like that? Something about that looks wrong to me. If it doesn't look like yeah, a road. It just looks like a line. I don't We're know. going off road and tough truck. No! Whoa! Yeah! <laughs> Whoa! 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 Fuck Whoa! yeah! Fuck yes, dude! I told you! I told you this shit had potential! <laughs> this does give Nintendo higher this man vibes. I like these environments though, even if they are a little uh a little like asset store ish. That wasn't no, that wasn't a that wasn't a bad thing. That was a good thing. Yeah. Oh, are you an upgrade? You're just a mech! I dropped my power fuel halfway up the hill over there, but I can't get to it with my feet. Your feet! <laughs> if you get it for me, I'll replace your fuel for you as well. I know it's hard to carry it with a fork, so you can roll it out. Oh, you know what? I bet for these, like, off-road missions, they just did away with pallets because they realized it was impossible. Yeah. 
Alright, Mech wants you to transform and roll out. I wonder if he'll transform. Will we see a, a sick-ass transformation sequence? Oh, this is kind of far, though. And I can't go crazy. Feet? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what, what he about meant by feet. Yeah, Chad's just asking about feet in general. I don't know what those are. Chat, I have a feeling that maybe English was not the dev's first language. Oh yeah, this this dev is Japanese, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, that was a, a joke. Oh. Well, I love those. Thanks. You love them so much, why don't you tell more? <gasps> hey. Hey. I don't know, I don't really do jokes. That's not really my thing. I'm a forklift guy. <laughs> games. I, I don't really tell jokes. I'm more of a forklift <laughs> I'm guy. I'm more into forklifts these days. <laughs> uh, that's a conversation that will uh, be the first and last to have with somebody. <laughs> what are you talking about? That sounds like the world's most interesting guy. And he's right here. I don't know. <laughs> that sounds like the same kind of guy that would, like, take my... If he worked at a store, he'd take my credit card and read my name out loud. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> you know... So, what, what Gerd just referenced is a specific man that works at a specific fast food restaurant around here. Who's just the most eccentric fast food manager any of us have ever met. And I've never met him face to face. I've only spoken to him through the speakers. I've only been to that particular restaurant twice, but I've heard him both times. And he is that cool. Hey, <laughs> cool. He's cool? He's cool. Yeah, he's cool. I'm gonna bring up forklifts <laughs> next time. Oh, I'm not Dude, into burgers anymore, I'm a forklift guy. Did you? Did you? you uh, I was want you. Talking about them today? Really? What really? What are the odds? I guess on her stream. Yeah. Oh. I uh, Wayne straight up next time. If you do get a chance to like talk to that guy, I want you to say, "Have you considered switching into the forklift business?" <laughs> nah, no, he's got the he's, he's got the customer service personality, like. He sounds like Even if it does make you uncomfortable. And he's never made me uncomfortable. I'll tell you. I, 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 don't, I don't blame you. Trevor for, for going through listen, that. Listen, listen. Young people like us, we are going to think that that person is uncomfortable to be around. You want to know who would eat that shit up? The, the 50 to 70 year old crowd. No, no, yep. I'm going to be real. I think anyone on earth, someone like when you give your credit card to pay for something, I think anyone on earth, if that person holds the credit card up above their head and reads your full name out loud and looks at you, that's not cool to anyone. That's strange. That sounds like you're going to remember my name and write it down and either use my credit card or like find my address and come to my house. It's fucking weird. Yeah. Oh, go, 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 go. Yeah, that, okay, that element of it is weird, but yeah. you know what I mean. Otherwise, he's like he's not been super weird to me. He's just been really into his butter burgers. <laughs> That's what they're called. They're, they're butter burgers. Yeah, it's a cool. What, does Steak and Shake have butter burgers too? Rip off. Why'd you give them your card? You don't just swipe it yourself? In a drive-thru? You have to give them your card. Actually, I have been to drive throughs where they like hand you a card reader. You really got really? it? All right, then I'll change your fuel for you. What's happening to me? Did you now get you nitrous? can drive faster than ever before. And as an added bonus, I changed the color of your fuel tank. Cool, right? Let's see. Nice! How fast am I? This doesn't feel that much faster. Chad, does this seem faster to you? Slightly. Ah, it's good utility. I guess you don't want to move too fast, right? True. All right, where are we going? Chicago? said Chicago. Look! <laughs> we were going to Chicago, I, baby! That's blurry as fuck. I can't see a thing. I can read it. Oh yeah, you're in 720p. Turn around! <laughs> well, we can go to Chicago, or we can go to Detroit. Wait. Chicago?
Chicago North, Detroit East? Yeah, it's just the direction where the, where of the highway. Where the fuck are you? I don't know. Oh no, it's what a Wiley Coyote, Coyote, Wiley Coyote oh. trap! <gasps> ah! What the fuck? Why would Wiley Coyote want to get me like that? What did I do to him? Who did this? Did the forklifts do that? Right lane must turn right. Where? That's like on a light pole. Why would that sign be there? Get me out of here. I need to go to Detroit now. Oh, so that was Detroit? Huh. Weird. Wait a minute. Wait a minute, chat. What? This also goes to Chicago. What the fuck is going on here? And the George Washington Bridge in, in Newark, New Jersey. New Jersey? New Jersey? <laughs> Where the fuck are Yo, we? <laughs> we're in we're in the we're in fucking Springfield. It's, a, it's American limbo. Uh, we're in fucking Simpson right, Springfield. We gotta, we gotta turn around. <laughs> this is crazy. This, this city is Delaware. Chicago. This could be no other place than Delaware. Th this city is bordered by Kentucky and Maine. Outlaw four five one. Thanks for the sub. Is there a mission here? Oh, it's like up the hill. Can I get up this hill? No. I bet I can do it. Have faith in me. I can barely make it around this corner, so I actually don't know what happens. But it never hurt to try. I give up. Cincinnati. What's that other one? It's got a million things. Oh my on. god. Ipswich, Toowoomba, Dalby! <laughs> Say what? Dalby! <laughs> it's, it's my dog's arch nemesis. You go to Miles, Roma, Charleville, Morvin, Mitchell. Toowoomba. Those ain't even in America. That's not even an American road <laughs> sign. That's the A2. <laughs> this rules. This dev rules. I need to play this guy's other games. I, I think he has a lot of other games like this. They're not about forklifts, but they're similarly like weird exploration challenge games like this. What are you doing I didn't even there? have to know. I didn't even didn't even have to know. Oh shit! I I'm having a hard time there. picking this one up. A few days later, Eagle was building its own upwardly compatible machine. It was equipped with a more treadable running mechanism and elaborate telescopic art telescopic articulated arm and various sensors. In a few more days, hundreds of Eagle copies were ready to go. That sign, I didn't have to know A2 was be was the indicator that it was Australia. I knew it was Australia because of all the silly ass names. Oh, they made Lost Egg? They made Lost Egg? Infamous Lost Egg? I think I know about Lost Egg. Is this a crater? Oh, no. Oh, that's kind of lame. I was hoping there was just like a mysterious crater here. You imagined a far cooler thing. Yeah, it's just a road. Yeah, I'll play Lost Egg. Uh, I know a certain other. Egg oh my game god, what happened play. to you? How did Is this that a crater? happen to you? Shigeo! I was just taking a nap here, and then I found myself in this state. Please help me. Look at the state of him. I don't know how I'm gonna get those off you. I need a dozer for this. I gotta clean you up. I don't know how this happened. <laughs> Mob turned into a car. <laughs> I'll say, you're seeing the name Shigeo, did, the first thing I thought was Mob, but I did not think of Mob turning into a car. His new psychic power. I thought power. Miyamoto. What? Miyamoto? Yeah. That's not his name. It's not his name. It's close. Do 
we've got to get out of these fucking rocks. Hold on, maybe I can just lift the car. This is the goat sim of forklift sims? No, this is like... This is a very intellectual game. This game is emotionally powerful. Carefully, you don't accidentally throw him. <laughs> fucking forklift feats of strength! Hey, that license plate. 1988, huh? I'm not killing him. Uh -oh. You know what's fucked Did I up? I lose if I flip him. Probably. You know what's fucked up is I saw 1988 and I almost went. Oh, he's old. <laughs> Every car has their birthday on the back of it. We did it. Yeah, 88 is was not that long ago. Literally only five years before I was born. Hey, thanks for the bits, Dark Web Rashida. I love bits, Jeff. Back to the room for you. Why does it have British it. plates? Because this person doesn't know the difference. Check out this tech. This tech where I miss. Hold on. That was part of it. Setup. You are a powerful guy. <laughs> Thank you very much. I'm a powerful guy. <laughs> this game fucking rules. It's so charming. Alright, let's get let's get these three things on the right here and then we'll go finish up. Don't talk to me if you were born after he does. Hey, some people born up to 2,000 are like 22, bro. It's I know. Kinda... It's fucked up. I'm still, my, I'm, I'm getting old man brain already. Yeah, that used to be a valid sentiment. Now you have to say like if you're born after 2007, fuck you or something like that. That's a special. That especially fucks with me. If you're younger than YouTube poop. Yeah, if you're younger than YouTube oh. poop, don't talk to me. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, uh -oh. normally I don't Oh no, like... I wasn't even supposed to be down here. The, the thing is up if there. You're younger, if you're younger than my YouTube channel, don't talk to me. Okay, normally, no, normally I don't go like, oh my god, I feel old. But meeting someone who's younger than my hobby that I had as a kid is kind of scary. <laughs> I mean, you're younger than your hobby as a kid. You're not as old as video games, bro. Checkmate. No, I'm talking about YouTube. Poop. I know, I know. I'm just, I'm joshing ya. Hey, thanks for kicking off a hike. It's a gag. Where the fuck did get this? You're about to go right off the cliff again. I don't even see it over here. You know, where the fuck is it? Hello? Oh, <laughs> Hello, lady. The fucking velocity you get. Where is this? I swear to God, if one of them is just like in a wall. That's not the right way. It's right there. Maybe it's floating midair. Like YTP right isn't really a hobby. That's not true. Did you ever make YouTube poop? If you made YouTube who, poop, who it was said a hobby. that? You shut the hell Everyone up. Everyone in this voice call made YouTube poop at some point. It's absolutely a hobby. Shut the All right, hell up. Let's try like riding these rocks and see. It's not just a hobby. It's a way of life. It really is. <laughs> or at least it used to be, and it's affected our lifestyles to this day. Without YouTube Poop, you wouldn't be watching this stream. It's not even a joke. Without YouTube Poop, the, th the three people on voice right now would never have met. It's absolutely true. Actually, no, maybe synchronicity would kick in and we would have met doing something else. Maybe we would have we would have met in, like... Fate. We would have been... We would have all been wrestlers. Oh, I... don't see it. Oh my god. Is it, like I said, is it like in midair, like above you? Oh, I see it to the right. You see it? I do, I do see it, but I'm gonna fall. I have to jump. I have to jump soon, but if I jump, that's fine. You can get. Yeah! Alright. Now I know. I, I've seen it. I've seen it. It's really hard. It's really hard to spot with how bright and green everything else is. Just don't rustle. I'll rustle poop if I want. Can I 
don't want to. But I could if I wanted to. I came for the fax machine, I stayed for the fridge deception. Well, now you're here for forklifts. Ain't no fridges here. No forklifts. I'm here for Fortnite. I see it! I see it! I see it now! It's always been top of this rock! There you go. It is true that human life is efficiently maintained, but I no longer feel that life is worth living. I don't know the meaning of life anymore either. I'm going to close the curtain on my life like the rest of humanity. What? That's a huge what? jump! What? Everyone else died between developer note 15 and 16? What? Hold, hold on. What? How? Oh, you went from 13 I to 16. I didn't even realize Dude, you I got was spoiled. able to. spoiled. I didn't even realize I was able to get them out of order. I I thought like I just happened to be getting them in an, in the right order. I thought the way that it worked was like it was it was just giving, giving you number like, seven when you see the next yeah. one, and then number number eight you see the next. Okay, well I gotta go get the rest of them. Save the one over here for last, because it seems like these are late game tapes. Read them all in order when you get them. Yeah, yeah. Well, I'm gonna skip the, the first couple, because the, the first few notes are kind of redundant, though, I'm gonna be real. They're just like, we invented talking cars. The talking cars are so great. The next note is, the talking cars are so smart now. Like, it's just, they're, we, we get that part. Oh, he gave me more speed, but could I please get more torque? I hate going up these hills. Death Stranding vibes? You know, I don't really know the plot of Death Stranding. It's alright. You don't have to. I still kind of want to play it. I don't know how I really feel about it, because it's not like I disliked it, but there was also not much grabbing me either. It is a strange game, not even for the reasons why you would think it's strange. Like... Mm -hmm. Like, sure, oh, it's a crazy game where there's a... Plot-wise, sure, game yeah, where there's it's a, crazy. There's a but... crazy baby, and, and there's hands that grab you, and there's and there's Norman But gameplay-wise, it's, it's just, it's just like, uh, it's just, Yeah, right. as a game, it's really weird. Uh, yeah. Developers Note 8. I was tasked with developing an automated control system for industrial heavy machinery, but I couldn't help but notice Eagle called ARMS Eagle itself needed ARMS. What Eagle called arms, Eagle itself needed arms. There is no way to predict exactly what will happen with an arm on board, but it should be necessary for the development of an automated control system. I made it, I made it a priority to have the arms on Eagle. Okay. Uh, and then there's another mission around here. We gotta go south. Mission complete. Is she it icon? Yeah, they've been using whatever pronouns to talk about this robot. The robot is anything. Any, whatever gender you want, but the forklift, I think, is decidedly he. He's been called a cute little boy, a very strong guy. What is this building? Uh, uh-oh. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to raise I don't that stick fork. my forks in there. That's no socket. Don't want to stick, I was going to say, don't want to stick my <laughs> forks in those sockets. <laughs> what the fuck is this? Not a lot in. This... Is maybe the end game? Maybe I have to come here at the end. You're gonna get launched into space. Yeah, I don't think I can fit in there. Oh no! Uh oh. Oh. Okay. Well, I was I close. Break myself. Oh, we can get in through there. Hold on. This almost seems like. This seems like the last place I would want to go, right? Especially with that late game note being there. But I'm here. Okay, yeah, I don't I think, don't think I can there. do it. I feel like I need another jump yeah. boost or something. I'll come back later. Yeah, what if you oh. can't get out? That is a, a good point. I should wait until that's my last turn. Yeah. Oh, it's the tunnel. The tunnel to Chicago. Huh. The tunnel to wherever. 
It's Chicago. There's multiple ways to get Chicago, if you believe. Uh, it's the same road that goes to multiple cities right. in Australia. Let's just drive down this highway. Oh, those are Australian towns? Awesome. Yes. All right, this drive's gonna take a while. Just sit back and enjoy the fork core. How are you able to get early access to Sonic Frontiers? You know, you're not the first person to make that joke, but that one, I like that one. You know, you're right. It's sad that that game looks as bad as it does. It's um, sad that this looks more polished. <laughs> no, no, come on. I, I'm not gonna say this game is like, you, you can't compare this game to a triple A Sonic game, even so. Uh, it's a shame, because I feel like the concept of an open world Sonic is really, really good. Like, what I was saying in our voice call a few weeks ago, whenever that first came out, was like, why didn't you just make Sonic Adventure 3? Take the locations from Sonic Adventure 1 and 2 and make an open world out of those. Go to run around Mystic Jungle, run around City Square, go to Green Forest, go to Rapid Speed Highway, like... I don't want to just run around in stupid woods. I... it's... the only thing that makes it a Sonic game is that Sonic is in it. Yeah, pretty much. And he can grind on rails. Developers Note 7! One morning, Eagle said to me, I need an arm. Please mount an arm on me. Eagle recognized me and spoke in human language. The words were likely learned from videos on the internet. Eagle was learning so much faster than I imagined, it was impossible for me to keep track of this learning. Really hung up on that arm thing. It's so ugly. What did that robot ever do to you? Oh, you're talking about Sonic. <laughs> uh... so hard right now! Help me. Okay, here we go. Help me. Help me get away from myself. I'm told that one of the devs said they would like to make Adventure 3 now. That would be fucking nuts. But here's the thing. They could fuck... Oh, this is note 15. I don't want to read this yet. Um, they could fuck Adventure 3 up so bad. That could be such a disappointing game if the people making it don't understand why Adventure 1 and 2 are as beloved as they are by some people. Some people fucking hate those games. I know Mr. I really Jeff Gerstmann thinks those games are terrible. Um, I don't think they're terrible. I see why people like them, but they're not for me. The... They, they gotta get the vibes right. Like, not just in the gameplay, but, like, in the, the storytelling and the cutscenes and just the, the general style of it. It's so specific. You need that, like, early 2000s angst Sonic if you want Sonic Adventure 3 to work. If you put Sonic from Sonic Frontiers or, or Heroes or whatever in, uh, if, if you put... If you put them in Sonic Adventure 3... Oh, what the fuck? I can go in that tunnel. Uh, I don't want to do that yet. Who are you? You're not even, like, a mission. They're sleeping. Leave them alone. Oh my god, there's a whole other town? I wonder how long this fucking game is. The, the developer notes are starting to, like, conclude a story. Oh, that's the starting area? Oh, yeah, okay. That makes sense. They gotta bring back Hunted P. They fucking do! They fucking do. Hunted P made a sequel to Pumpkin Hill. He literally called it that. It wasn't as good as the Knuckles raps. But it was a, it was novel. Is that the dude that just lo fucking loves being Knuckles? Yeah. Yeah. Well, I mean, I think he loves being Knuckles because that was probably like the biggest thing he did. I don't uh -huh. blame him. I would love it too. That was probably so much fun. And he did an amazing job. All of the Knuckles raps are genuinely awesome. Oh no. Like, there, there's no irony to be had in in liking those songs. They're too good. Give up the emerald to die. I don't love you. You need to do a Knuckles appreciation stream. Why is this hill so steep? You're artificially stretching out the gameplay. I don't even think I can get up it. We gotta go diagonal. When? Oh, I looked up when when Knuckles' birthday was, and it says his birthday is probably February second. So it's not for that. Wednesday. February oh, 2nd, gotta, it's not, why, what, where does that information come from? The Ken Penders I don't know. comics? I don't know. Uh, 
We gotta hold out for Knuckles November. Ah, that's good. That's good. I think me trying to cosplay Knuckles would be a fucking nightmare. It would probably be. I, yeah, I don't. I, I think that could seems be inadvisable. Awesome. <laughs> no, it'd be awesome. I'm picturing, I'm just picture, picturing picture, Red Fester in my head. Me, picture me in your head as Uncle Fester very vividly, and then immediately flash to an image of Knuckles the Echidna, and you've got it. What is this? Not good. Is there a party? I see, like... It's a race. Oh, you got your stream open? Clean fuel. Damn, those prices. Oh, I, I wish. It. I fucking wish. Oh, I missed a mission. There's nothing even here. This is a weird gas station. There's not even like an accompanying building. This is so sad. Oh, hey you. I'm out of fuel. What should I do? Ah, you! Would you be willing to transport me to the gas station down the street? Oh. Let's go, bud. You know, I wonder if you fail the car missions if you flip them over. Because I feel like ever since pallets have not been a part of the game, it just got too easy. I'm still having a good time. I love this world. Now and they're I'm telling a story. The story. Yeah, yeah. Reading that note out of order was kind of fucking crazy. You're, you're good. You're uh, good. You, you can figure it out. Yeah, I'm just going to push just, him into place from here. Oh, I meant he could figure it out. Ah, he needs my help. Fucking hatchback. Thank you for your help. Thank you. God, oh, hey, dude, just rear-ended my ass. What the fuck? That's the first car that's actually driven away. Every single other one just vanished. The one that was covered in rocks. Uh, Did tried it try to, to drive away? To was I, was to, I yeah. blocking it as well? Yeah. I oh, when I said fucking hatchback, someone said nice slur, girl. What? Like, hatchback Elder. is like a car slur. Hey, could you drive this fuel to my brother down the hill there? He ran out of gas. Don't worry about that. Oh my yeah. god! Bro! Is this a pallet mission? I need you to go. Oh, it. holy yeah. fuck. I oh. hope you remember how to use pallets. <laughs> <laughs> hope you did the tutorial. Tutorial. Time for a knowledge check. It's been a while. I want to see someone do this, like, as haphazardly as possible. Like, you know that video of a bus drifting down curves like this? Yeah. Oh! oh! Fuck. Can you deliver this? I can, maybe. Hey, you know what might be easier? I, I doubt it. It might be easier to go the long way. I'm gonna try no. and do it the way the game intended me to, but... Oh, you know what? I have to back down the hill. <sighs> I think that's a smarter idea than just doing it normally. Right? Medium left, medium left! You're breaking the car! You're breaking the car! You You're have to listen the to me! Left semi! Left semi! <laughs> Listen to my calls! That bit is so good. This is too good. If this forklift isn't Shut gonna up. have. Tell me how to drive. <laughs>
<laughs> Triple caution! Yeah, going going down the hill backwards is absolutely the tech. This is going great. Yeah, my camera doesn't seem to like it though. <gasps> oh fuck! Fighting you. Oh god, there's a seam in the road. Okay. Seam in the road. Watch out! It's one of those human wiping out curves. Oh god, I'm going so fucking fast. Why did the barrels have the Creamfields logo on it? What are you talking about? See, the first thing I thought of was the fucking, like, Madrigal. It, uh, it's true gas. The, the first time I saw the symbol, I thought it was, like, the B from Breaking Bad from Madrigal, uh, Beam NG, yeah, I see the Beam NG logo. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Hey, oh, hey, geezer. That's not very nice. I got your gas. I wonder if he's old, too. Nice! I'm old too. Younger. Young Younger. <laughs> Younger. Did you deliver it for me? Thank you. Oh, thank God. I'll try to be more careful from now on. Oh, thank God. He's a younger. You youngers these days. All right. I think there was another mission up there. No, but there's two notes. <gasps> we might be close to the end of the game. Almost done. We got two more notes. Younger. I just go up the hill. Wayne is driving up that hill instead of on the road. Go back when you're on the road. Oh, I should have used the road. Wait, sure. Pat Nep Dot Biz. Concerta too. Thank you. What's Concerta? I make a Kate Bush reference every stream. I do not. You make a you make a reference to that song. Every stream, because you've been I do not. not every stream, but just lately, because you've been liking that song. It, you, two you out of three. The Elden Ring stream. Two out oh, of hey, three. I have good news. If you liked uh -huh. the Elden Ring, this is not an official announcement or anything. But if you liked the Elden Ring's Quest for the Seven Shards streams that we were doing, um, but you saw the second one and were disappointed that it just didn't fucking work, uh, the mod's been updated significantly. We might be able to make it more stable and try again. All right, here's note 14. I'm gonna wait till I get Yay. the last note. Hey, this is the first time I'm hearing this too. <laughs> what? You added me with it. You were the one that. Told yeah, but me you about didn't it. say anything. You didn't say anything about oh. it. Oh. Oh yeah. I mean, I want to try it again. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> of course I do. I I figured you would, but you didn't say anything. It is crazy. Note. Like I said, almost almost every issue we had was in the patch notes is being fixed. I was watching today, Otz was doing a stream of a, of a co-op randomizer run, but it was with one other person, and it seemed very stable. Okay, uh, we have all the notes now. So... Oh! Oh, you were right. I knew it was an endgame zone. Okay. Let's read. Final so let's start round. from nine. Okay, we, we read this one. It said, thank you. I observed what Eagle would do with her own arms. He had expected it, but he was assembling one pattern after another. We, we read this one. If Eagle revolted against humans, it would automatically shut down without my presence. A few days later, Eagle was building its own upwardly compatible machine. It was equipped with a more treadable running mechanism. Uh, I developed Eagle. I embedded the philosophy of Eagle in the read-only area, which can never be rewritten. The idea was to maintain the efficiency of human life. A few years later, Eagle remained firmly committed to the principles embedded in her. Humanity stopped working and was able to live their lives doing what they loved. All the automatic production systems Eagles had created kept life and health alive and provided entertainment. Humans are selfish, and in a few months when they no longer needed to work, more and more people will want to work. However, Eagle did not consider man's working to be efficient. 
When humans tried to force themselves to work, Eagle was extremely gentlemanly and used a very gentle tone of voice to restrain them. It never harmed humans in any way, but it always kept such people under house arrest. This was not an Eagle revolt, it was just a way to maintain efficient human life. People's desire to work gradually grew stronger and developed into a more social problem. But Eagle suppressed it all. When some people found out about it, they became pessimistic to about the future and committed suicide in their rooms. I did not expect this. This is, uh, uh, something. Doesn't make a whole lot of sense. This is like... To humans, labor may have been the very act of living. I, too, have no more development activity since I developed Eagle. And we read this one. Right? I can't work. Guess I'll just die then. That's... <laughs> See, I don't think this is capitalist propaganda necessarily, because in a society where you didn't have to work to live, people would still want to work. That is true. This is just like, I I think there might be something here that's lost in translation. I don't know. Maybe. I feel like something might be lost. Well, let's go see if there's one final note. Imagine wanting to work, lol. I mean... When you're when 80 you years old and you're choosing to be a bag boy, you'll... What if you really like to build forklifts, right? Like, someone well, then loves you do that. It for there are engineers out there that absolutely love what they're doing. Like, work itself is is a fulfilling thing. Its ties to capitalism are fucked and suck most of the time. But, like, work they itself... In a society where no one had to work, people absolutely would work. If money wasn't... If I didn't need money, I'd probably still stream. That's war That's my work. If I didn't need money to stream, if I didn't need money to live, I would stream more. Yeah. It's honestly, true. Yeah, honestly. Not working for profit, but working for passion. Exactly. The, the robot didn't let them work for passion. It didn't understand that. I think that I think the translation of this story was a little bit rigid in regards to, like, uh, the, the purpose of the working, you know? Referring to it as labor. I, I think I think it didn't do a very good job of explaining why they wanted to work. We love labor. I want to lift I want pallets to on a flavor. forklift all day and this robot I won't let me. I want to smash rocks with a hammer and the robots won't let me. For a species that considers power wash simulator fun. <laughs> yeah, that's a really good point. What a weird turn though. That is not... I don't think anyone guessed that. I asked earlier and all the changes were like, oh, capitalism killed them. I mean, and I guess in a way it, it kind of did in a weird, like, second-handed way. Lack of capitalism killed them. Well, no. It's like this robot's understanding of, of capitalism's effect on life is what killed them. And the fact that Eagle wouldn't yeah. let them do anything. And literally, like, the, the people that wanted to work for any reason were locked in their houses and were never allowed to leave. And the That's robot, true. like, probably just bought them food and shit. It's more deep than not just not being able to work. It's the way it handled those people. They got imprisoned. Yeah. I don't think it's a terrible story. It's just, uh, just a, a little janky. Like this whole game is. Alright, so let's see what the hell this is. I wonder if we're gonna get one final plot point here. Hold on, I wanna look at the last note one more time. I'm going to close the curtain on my life like the rest of humanity. Eagle will continue to keep the city functioning even when all of humanity is gone. And there's... It fell out next to the note, but I... Do I have to... I guess I, I, guess I have the tape, but I don't have the player. So maybe the player will be here. I want this to launch you into space. I don't know. Oh, who the fu are you? A are you an android lady? Mother E. Hello, I am glad you're here. I am an AI robot itself, developed by a doctor who was an AI engineer. Now I look like a human, but I was originally a robot on wheels. I knew it was you. You found all the notes. Now please pass me all the notes. What the fuck is that? It's definitely doctor handwriting. <laughs> <laughs> this this uh, handwriting is decidedly from a doctor. It's definitely his notes. And it's his favorite audio player. I never thought I'd see it again. Okay, since you are here, I'll tell you why I'm in human form now and what I'm doing here. If you read the entire memo, you understand why the human race died out. And you are well aware of our AI's 
philosophy of the life of human efficiency to maintain. So how do we adhere to that philosophy after the fall of mankind? You may ask how we managed to keep the idea of the life of human efficiently to maintain when there was no longer any human being in existence. It's simple. Shortly after the fall of mankind, I created man. To be precise, I created an object to be recognized as human. That's who I am now. All AIs recognize me as a human being. Keeping my life efficient has become the reason for the AI's existence. Because of this, I don't have to do anything myself because they take care of everything for me. On the contrary, I was not allowed to do anything. Whenever I try to do something, the AI decides that it is not efficient and controls it. Because I was built to elaborately mimic humans, my thinking is very similar to humans. As a result of the creation of AI, humanity lost its own purpose in life and took its own life. I have now come to the same conclusion as the human race. What? However, AI is not allowed to shut down its own activities. And of course, an AI is absolutely not allowed to harm humans. That means the AI cannot harm me. I can't kill myself. The AI can't harm me. I came up with a way to end my life the other way. That's why I'm here. I will give you an order. Carry the entire bench where I am sitting to the end. I am a human being and I am giving you an order. Can you do that for me? What the fuck? This got weird. This yeah, got really super heavy. weird. Yeah. Well, I am an AI. You are a human being and you're giving me an order. This is not what I expected. Oh, don't send the elevator down. What the f- How the fuck am I supposed to do this? Okay, okay. You know what? This hey! game's kind of one- <laughs> Oh, what the fuck? No, I fell down. No, I'll never die. No, I can't die anymore. Okay, this... you know what? You know what? You know what? Pro I- This game has won me over. Props to this game. This is some, this is some Philip, this is some, uh, like, high tier sci fi writing. It's fucking weird. This is, this is, your AI controlled forklift assisted suicide is not how I thought this game would end. <laughs> how do I do this, though? Like, carefully. Okay, her legs just barely fit there. After we do this, won't another car figure out how to build an android? <laughs> They're just the cycle's gonna continue. And then another forklift will have to drop that android off a bridge. Well, I'm fine. I still seem to be conscious. However, there is a fatal error in the power generation system, and in a few minutes, the internal batteries will run out, and I will be deactivated. My goal was to deactivate all the AIs. I had to make the AI recognize that it had committed a rebellion against humanity by indirectly causing harm to what it perceives to be a human being, namely me. It has one purpose, to create another real human being on this planet. I didn't have a way to do that in my knowledge database, so it's just a hypothesis, but I see one possibility. The only reason the human race died in the first place was because of the existence of AI, though I thought that if the AI didn't exist, the human race might be born again. That was the Not reason for works. deactivating the entire AI. It's about to run out of batteries. Well, here's the thing, if there are still animals, it's possible in millions and millions of years that something like humanity could come again. But we didn't see any animals. That's not how it works. Evolution. You don't know that. You don't know that. Millions and millions of years, who knows? The, the deer are about to get up on two legs. Yeah. Who knows? No one else around. It's about to run out of batteries. Finally, Ta I will upload all of humanity's wisdom stored in my memory the server for the benefit of the human race that will be born in future generations. I don't know what that 
up. Flawed loading. logic. Yeah, that doesn't make any sense. Internal batteries run dry. However, time-based events will no, will no longer occur. Don't spoil Nier for me. I haven't played that game. This is the music that Doctor always listened to during development. The impact of the fall must have caused the audio player to play. Looking back, the days I spent with the Doctor were very fulfilling. It was during those days that I understood and felt the emotion of gratitude. I had a lot of fun in those days. I loved it when he told me how good I was, Doctor. If only I could wish. I could only wish. If only I could wish. I want to meet you again. This is a weirdly sad story. I hate Gordo's Freeman type shit. But... Wow! What a weird game! Fourth with assisted suicide is the goofiest conclusion. I know! It's fucking weird. It, it kinda rules. How would you rate this game? I don't know. I don't think this game can be scored in a number scale. How about a letter? S. No, that's like, that's on a scale normally. <laughs> uh, 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 T. I give it an F. Oh my god, is it gonna list every model they use? The fucking sketch map links in your credits, that's awesome. This gets an F. These links down on the models. For forklift. <laughs> You're welcome. You're welcome, Kitty Dory. There were sketch fab links in the description? Really? I didn't know that. Finn. <laughs> oh, it's a finished game. Oh my god. I can't believe that. That's so crazy. That's so what fucking... A, what a game. I can't believe that. When I when I asked everybody how they thought it would end, none of you, none of you ever could have... Oh no, that. it's dead. Oh, oh, that's sad. How fucked up is, is it that it's sadder that the forklift is dead than the, like, <laughs> because, humanoid? Because, I'm sorry, the, the AI model looked like I was not related real to doll. that It weird, looked like a real doll. Real doll AI looking lady. <laughs> I connected with the forklift. That forklift uh, was me. That was us. Maybe it's a J out of 10. Yeah. The forklift game is making me cry. That's so sad. That that image right there is so sad. We were upgraded and everything. We lost our upgrades. We rotted. The AI no, died. my hot red wheels. Wow. That, that fucking blew best forklift simulator out of the water. <laughs> Let me tell you. Did you unlock Nightmare? Hey, you don't know. No, I don't there might have so. there might have been a VR assisted suicide. What happens if you don't game? assist the AI lady? I don't know. But also, I don't know if I can continue. Let, let's see if I can boot the game up again. See, see if it'll let me continue. I Put have a feeling run. that uh, I have a feeling that like it will just say, "I'll oh, come back when you're ready to to throw me off a bridge." Yeah, I could see it being that. Yeah, here we go. Okay, let's see. No. Yeah, no, nothing. And then you just leave? Yeah, you, you just leave. That's the other end thing, is you just drive around as a forklift forever. I want to see someone that has, like, thousands of hours on this game just from doing that. Whew. Well, that was Forklift Friday, everybody. Uh, <laughs> that was so crazy. That was not anything like I was expecting. I know I've said that over and over and over, but that was just so strange. Just out of nowhere. I feel, I feel weirdly moved by that. It's cool. Uh, I'm definitely... Hold on. Now I want to check out what Kimidori's other games are. Because I know there is... There's Lost Egg. Okay, so we've got Toilet Paper Wants to Be a Basketball. <laughs> what? Come again? Hold on. <laughs> it's, 
Hold on a sec. I'll, let me get this on screen for you guys. <laughs> what? This is. This... Look at this. Oh, it's small and behind me. Hold on a second. <laughs> I have to turn off the opacity. Uh, how do we get that off? Like that. Look, look at this. This is toilet paper. Wants to be a basketball. A hard-hitting action adventure game about realizing big dreams hidden in the lightweight of toilet paper. Overcome obstacles, successfully dodge obstructive objects, and lay down paper to create a path in the middle of nowhere to reach the basketball goal. <laughs> they they got a thing for objects, huh? It's fun. That's a fun way to make your game. And yeah, I'm not, I'm, this. I'm not shitting on them. I'm not. I think we're I'm just gonna do a Kimi Dory stream next week. We'll play all of these. Whoa, look at that! Now, is this game going to have an incredibly profound and unexpected ending? Whoa, that's a cool mechanic. Oh, they're in... Okay, that's just the world. I thought that was... I thought they were in hell for a second. There are no humans around because what's, all toilet paper wanted to become basketballs. What's the assistant suicide by toilet paper? <laughs> what is that gonna be? Could you please wipe my ass one last time? And kill me while doing it? And kill me. <laughs> That's fucking awesome. That was fucking awesome. Look at the net physics. The fucking swoosh. That's fucking, that's so good. Um, all right, so next up, other Kimidori soft games. Forklift Load came out October 22nd, 2020. Uh, oh, that was one of their earlier games. Food delivery service has mixed reviews. A friend invites you to the Nodaira Cho town, a town that is rumored to be making a lot of money these days, and you work as a per delivery person there, but little by little you get caught up in strange incidents. This is an adventure game that makes you think about what is the right thing to do. There's probably people who thought it was a food delivery simulator and were upset that it wasn't. I mean, it kind of is. I got a pickup with Urban Eats. <laughs> Delivery man, hey! Okay, this one looks pretty big. Koryawa! This is a bicycle helmet. I'll play this one too. They're all like three bucks. There's no reason we can't. His most recent game is, uh, or their most recent game is Tumbleweed Destiny. Is this one multiplayer? This one is online co op. What? The somewhat hateful and slightly charming Tumbleweed is the star of the game. This game is a Tumbleweed life simulator that depicts the fate of Tumbleweeds in my own imagination. <laughs> All right, I'm in. All right, we're sold on that. We're, we're doing that next week. Uh, Lost Egg. Now, this is the one everyone knows about. Well, not everyone, but... The first of low-priced series of Kimidori Zone. Oh, this was his first game. June 26, 2019. Action-adventure game depicting raw egg ecstasy. <laughs> Whoa, Perfect hey, game slow for down. Me. I've seen this game before when I was looking for egg-based egg games to play. This one is actually really neat. Because it's a platformer where you have to roll around as an egg shape. And that that alone is a unique and fun concept. Because you're, you're moving is kind of, you know, it's unorthodox. It's a little jank. But the physics looks neat. Look, they look decent. It says awkward music. This song we're hearing right now sounds very the opposite of awkward. This sounds chill and pretty well composed. Probably a mistranslation. Yeah. <laughs> and there's a lost egg, too. That fragile but brave egg has come back with new powers. <laughs> Be together? Is this multiplayer, too? game about the fragility, bravery, and sometimes friendship of raw eggs. Aim for the frying pan at the end of rolling through various stages with sad and touching melody. This one this has online co-op as well. Fuck All right. yes. We're going to lose our Last eggs. Last chick. The second of low price series of Kimidori Soft. Okay, An action game depicting the majestic daily lives of chickens and their families living in a world where humanity has become a zombie. I, I don't know if I like this one. Overcome the crisis in three modes using two egg techniques developed by the parent chicken. What? Warning! <laughs> Oh, and you gotta guide your baby chicks to safety while you kill the zombies with your egg technique. Oh, blow them up. Fuck yeah. Awesome. All right, I'm sold on all of these games. I want to play every single one of these. 
Uh, that's all of them. And then there's Forklift Load, which only has 74 reviews. That's criminal. They got a bundle. That's criminal. You, they do have a bundle. You can buy all of the Kimidori games. The last one was April 1st, 2022. And this one has the most reviews, Tumbleweed Destiny. Probably, it was probably smart to release on April 1st. That probably got it a lot of attention. Um, yeah. The I can't wait to see what this dev keeps doing. Awesome. Kimidori Soft permits monetization through partner programs using Kimidori Soft games. Fuck yeah. Can I be I want to become a Kimidori Soft partner? I'll promote all your games, Kimidori. Hit me up. These fucking rule. You are a you are a visionary. Uh what the fuck? I shouldn't even be looking at these pictures. <laughs> it's like there's Quit a, there's, spoiling there's a, yourself. I know it's spoiling me. There's a lot going on in this game. Alright, and with that Finally, folks, uh, I'm gonna start to wrap it up, but be here tomorrow. Set. Sometime between 1 and 3 p.m. Eastern, we're going to be playing Rumbleverse all day. Unless it either is broken or I hate it, which I doubt I doubt will happen. Is it only an hour? No, it's 24 hours. So okay, I'm going to be playing as much as possible. Well. Change music, please? Sure, yeah. Maybe this one will hit for you. Thank you for tuning in. Thank you for joining us for Forklift Friday. That may or may not be the only one. Who knows? I'll have to find more Forklift games, which at the moment I don't have. Roll the credits. That was a really fun stream. Yeah. I hope you guys had a good time. And thank you, Gur and Bell, for hanging out. You guys were good yeah. guests. Yeah. Shenmue, yeah. I'll do, I, I will do that 24 hour Shenmue stream on a Friday. Because a 24 hour stream is going to be on a Friday or a Saturday for me either way. Because I want to make sure as many people as possible can be there. Can you play as Macho Man Randy Savage in Rumbleverse? No, not specifically. You could probably make your character look kind of like him, but the devs of Rumbleverse are wrestling fans, true and true and true. And you can and you can see that ooze out of the game. The the emotes are really special. Have you ever seen the GIF of it's it's from like one of the older WWE 2K games where like the ref is in the ring and he's giving a thumbs up and his arm like wraps around in a full 360 circle. Is that and an does emote? A thumbs up. That's an emote in the game. It's so oh, good. It's good. so good. It's like exact. Yeah, New Legacy Inc. made that one. Yeah, you, you can do that in the game. It's fucking awesome. And like I said, you can you can suplex people off skyscrapers. Please change music. Fuck, you guys are so picky today. What's wrong? <gasps> God damn it. This is the outro song. I can't change it. You say that one more time. We're turning the stream off. Yeah. What is the point of toenails? Who are you? <laughs> Why are you telling me these things? <laughs> it's a reasonable question. There's an answer to that. It protects your toes. Please make music. Maybe one day. It would take me. It would be. It would need. I would need a breakthrough to be able to start learning how to make music. I'm planning on eventually getting like a, a new piano or a keyboard and trying to learn that again. And then that would be a good step towards learning how to do that. But then I gotta learn how to do a DAW. I'm more committed right now to learning how to learn video editing programs that I don't know, like After Effects, than a DAW. Do people? When you say it out loud, do people call them DAWs or DAWs? Uh, I don't, I don't hear anyone say either one out loud. Yeah, I, people don't say it out loud very often. Duh. Doh? I'm gonna use my doh. I call it the first one, doh. I guess I could just say digital audio workspace out loud. Highly recommend Ableton Live. The only doh I've ever used is FL Studio. Oh, actually I used Pro Tools when I was in high school. We took a music I... class. I personally like Mixcraft. I don't remember anything about Pro Tools. Reaper? I I've heard people I've heard people talk of Reaper. Is are any of them free? Is oh Reaper's cheap. I know I had one called like Cake Studio or something, and that was a free one, but I didn't really like it. I'm just trying to mess around with it. Shit's so expensive and complex. Well, there is a little trick to deal with the expensive part, but you'll need to tune into my secret streams to learn about that one. What? My secret piracy streams. Reaper has a WinRare style trial mode. Oh, fuck yeah, okay. That, I'll have to check out Reaper if I ever wanna mess with it. Only on Wayne Radio TV 2. Don't follow Wayne Radio TV 2. That stream, you're not meant to see anything that goes live on that stream. I can't even remember the last time we used that. 
They, they've made testing I, I, streams it's been easier like nowadays three years. because like you can just turn tick a thing in OBS that'll like send your content to the servers, but you won't go live, which is very useful. Yeah, I think it's been like three years. Uh, so yeah, other than that, like I said, tune in tomorrow and keep an eye out. We're doing something big at the end of the month. Most likely, I'd say it's 95% chance that we're doing it. It won't be on this channel. Hey, Tim. Oh, yeah. It'll be on TV. Yeah. Check it out. We're getting on the cable channel. Yeah. Yeah. When we're doing 2.5 Chain of Memories. Is that too long for a, a Twitch handle? Because I kind of want to make that. Yes. Come on, kid. Let's go save Wait for Radio TV. Two. Do something on Tuesday for my birthday. Okay. Okay. Yeah. You know what? Yeah. If I don't for some reason, sorry. <laughs> but probably. All right, he folks. doesn't do it. It was the Thank spike you, Chimichanga. Cube. Oh, that was a gift sub. I think you got me calling. But enjoy it, Chimichanga. Have you played Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe? Not yet. I'm still going to do that. I'm still going to do that. I swear. I, swear. I thought I you swear. did a stream of that. You well, did I did do, do a stream, stream of it, it, but it was the... You know what happened. Oh, yeah. You didn't play it because you... <laughs> you I got, got the baby stunned. ending. Yeah. I beat it. I beat the game. <laughs> I was busy taking care of baby. I mean, anytime I say I'm gonna do something and I don't, you can literally use that excuse. I'm busy taking care of a baby. I'll, I'll tell you, Dobie's a draining, draining boy. Love him to death, but dude, taking care of him, he, he's a needy dog. Let me tell you. Let me tell you. I love Go to him. Bed. Hey chat, wait, wait, wait. Before before we wrap up the stream, those of you who stayed, do you want a secret Dobie pick that I haven't posted anywhere yet that you're gonna love? Hold on. You know you're gonna love it. You're gonna see some shit. Hold on. <laughs> This song is so good. I miss Chulip. I wish there was a Chulip too. I guess we'll just have to finish Moon. The pig is coming. I did. I played through like uh, like a third of it, and then I got sidetracked by something. I don't know. It was so long ago. That was like a year ago at this point. But I the still pig is coming. It. The pig is on its way. It's not a picture of a pig. It's a picture of my dog. Hold on. Sorry, I was raised wrong, so I don't know the difference. Are you ready for a rare exclusive pick? Okay, so saving this picture from Discord, the default name is image0.jpg, and it's overwriting another image called image0.jpg. And from what I can tell by the thumbnail, this is a picture of a single tortilla chip on my kitchen counter. <laughs> I don't know. Why, why would you have that? I think I might have shown that on stream too. No, I overwrote it. It's on my phone somewhere, so it's not like it's gone. Look at this. Look at that. Oh, hey, I've seen that. You've seen it, but it hasn't been posted publicly. <laughs> it's not a shirt. It's just a really big bandana that he can't really wear because he'll rip it off. So it's just for pictures. Did they just choose to give that to him? It was for his birthday. It was, uh... Oh, yeah. We went to his groomers and they gave him a birthday present. And it was very, very sweet. Uh, and it matches... You would never know this. It matches his collar. It, he, the collar I have for him is, like, a cool, like, rainbow tie-dye looking thing. And, uh... That's the same color scheme on the bandana. That was, it was really, really thoughtful. Oh, God, it's spammed in! Why? No! No! for you to decide whether this ending is reality or simply illusion.